Okay. Addiction. Addiction, addiction, addiction. Bird. Get the bird. Open the bird game. Skip the intro? I would never. Actually, at this point, I might. I might, just so I don't spoil anything. I don't want to spoil the video game. Like, anything at all. See, it's like... Oh, I, I gotta click the button, right? Oh, I gotta click it. It looks, it looks so good. Do skip it. Oh, shit, but the song is so good. I want the song. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. We're back. It's been exactly one day. Why? Because I have a problem. Oh, man. So we're just gonna continue. Really, that's 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 it. I did a couple things right before the end last time, and I remembered that the game saved every night. So I have to do them over again anyway. As to what those things I did were, I don't remember. So let's go figure it out. I know I've activated that. Let me buy all the juice again. I gotta talk to Boog. Yeah. She liked the cake. We're level level four bonding experience. Can chat with Wriggle. Okay. And now I can get her to get some drinks for me as well. So I gotta go over here. And I'll get the do. I wonder how randomized this is. Like, if you could like save scum it for good good resources, or it's always the same every time. In which case you could still save scum it for good resources, huh? Get some do. I do need some seafood. Seaweed. I gotta buy stuff from the shop, and I should be back on track. Chen still hasn't visited me, so I can't give her the skewer yet. Okay, give me all your seaweed. Give me some of your tofu. Give me your pork. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. All right. Okay. Talk with Ruma. Yep. Now let me see, let me see. Let me think. So right now I don't have any, I don't have any tasks, do I? Just Chen. So in the meantime, uh, I can invite, I need Lamprey. Lamprey is the main priority, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna get some ingredients from from Ruma. Oh, she gave me flour and lamprey. Nice. I'm gonna get some ingredients from Ruma. I'm gonna get some ingredients from uh, Riggle, and then I'm gonna go fishing. Give me the ingredients: pork and venison. Okay. Beverages. Running out of drinks again. By the way, I heard there exists a bug who can make endless sake. Correct. Do you have one? I promise I'll feed it well. Technically, it's not a bug anymore. Because it's already domesticated by Oni. Does that mean you don't have any of them? What a pity. You could have just told me that you're short on beverages. I'll take care of that. Really? Thanks. Oh, well, I mean, that's not bad. <laughs> Thank you, Cora, for the resub. <laughs> give me some give me some popsicles. Yeah. Okay. So now I need uh I need to go fishing. So let's get some more lamprey, shall we? Oh, that's weird. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Hmm. Thank you, Ari, for the resub as well. Okay, I got some more lamprey. I wish lamprey wasn't so rare. It's my signature dish. Ah! It's about time. All right, it's time. Open up, level two. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have gone level two right away. Oh, this might be bad. Oh man, oh man, oh man. Okay, let's see. I, all right, I have tonkatsu ramen now. Broth made from boiling pork and vegetables is the essence of ramen. The smooth noodles are enriched by the flavor and aromatic pork broth filling and satisfying. Wow. Mmm. Mmm. can do pork and trout. Can I put lamprey back on the menu? For grilled lamprey. 26. 
I could go a day for that. Uh, do I want to? I think I want to... Rice balls, boiled tofu, sardines. Nobody wants the fucking eggs, dude. Nobody. Nobody gives a shit about the eggs. Uh... Yeah, let's get the pork bowl, I guess. And... Croquette? <laughs> sure. Yeah, sure, why not? Here's the drink menu. Okay. Alright, two cutting board, two steamers. Oh, okay, alright. Let's do it. Surely this doesn't go wrong. Okay. Let's just get it started. Time to waste another potato, because nobody ever wants this goddamn thing. I should just make a million fucking rice balls, honestly. Oh, 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 that's good. There you go. That's the good shit, I promise. I'm making rice balls preemptively. I like how the- I, I got the Totetsu feast. And she's- the, the character was walking away. While she's like, I'm gonna eat now. She already finished that shit. Alright, I have three rice balls now. Oh. Unexpected, but I'll take it. Okay. Whoosh! Gotta wait for the vibe. Whoosh. Whoosh. Wait, that's Tase. Oh, uh, shit. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh ah. -huh. Uh ah. -huh. Ah. Uh -huh. What you want? Dry sardines? Okay. What you want? I'm kind of Japanese uh, food enthusiast who can remember how many pieces of bread I've eaten in an iceable beverage. Iceable beverage. You know what's iceable? This dasai. Japanese food, huh? What do I have that's Japanese? I mean, I have a rice ball, but do I have something more expensive? I'm really trying to give her the biggest expensive. That's Western. Uh, that's Chinese. Um, that's Western. It's Western. I have only one thing I have here is Japanese style. It's a fucking rice ball. Oh my god. All right. What is Marissa like? Uh, legendary, Japanese, and trendy. That's premium. It's aquatic. Delicacy. A legendary meatball. Sure, why not? Here you go, enjoy. Okay, she liked it enough. I'll take that. Oh, you want more? The older it gets, the more legendary it becomes with an iceable beverage. You know what you're getting, right? You're getting this again. Sure. What's- I got flour. Common ingredient used. Oh, mixing's things filling. Oh, that's pretty good. Okay. You think she likes spicy stuff? I feel like that would be a Marissa thing, but I don't want to gamble on it, you know?
There you go. Good enough. Damn it. Low alcohol beverage. Uh. You know what? I'm giving her. I'm giving her a spicy one. See if she likes it. <laughs> so hopefully this doesn't go badly. Wait, that's Chen. Hit a shit! Oh, she loved it. Yeah! <laughs> truffle, truffle, mushroom. There you go. Wait, Chen's here. Dry beverage. Um, and it was uh, the grill. Uh, what was it? Pork and fish? Yeah, that's it. That's meat, aquatic, barbecue. She likes sweet, yeah? I think she likes sweet. She likes sweet and greasy. Okay. Okay. I'll get you in a second, Marissa. Right, I don't have the... There you go. She liked it. Number one. Ah. Chen likes meat. Duh. You want it again? I'm giving you a spicy one again. The old spicy meatball. Pork bowls. Okay. Uh, iceable beverage. You know what's iceable? <laughs> uh, Alright. I may- I'm- Jesus, Marissa. You're gonna be able to handle all this? What do I have in stock right now? Cocaine and a rice ball. Okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh. Marissa's rich, dude. Bland is never my taste. Add oil and bring out the taste. And an iceable beverage. She likes greasy food. You know what's greasy? Greasy, strange, legendary, spicy. And what was that? You want another iceable beverage? Oh, yes you do. Peep this. Not bad. Marissa hates strange food. That that was unexpected. I can't say I expected that from Marissa. Doesn't she eat like mushrooms and drink potions and shit? What do you mean she doesn't like strange food? Why does everybody want a pork bowl? Holy shit. <laughs> hold on, Riggle. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There goes my pork supply. Riggle's ability isn't gonna matter at this point anyway. Nobody wants a rice ball anymore. What do you want, Riggle? Uh, meat tastes better. Raw meat tastes better. Well, I know, I'm giving you the cicada shells anyway. 
Sweet raw meat. Actually, don't use the pork. I need the pork now. The pork is actually kind of important to the pork bowl, so use that. Low alcohol beverage. Low alcohol. Okay. Okay, that's... doesn't really help me. Oh my god, Riggle's still not done eating. Oh, I wasn't expecting the pork bowl to be such a hit, dude! As an insect, I never say no to abnormal food and iceable beverage. Bing, 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 bing. Iceable. I ran out of that expensive shit. Look at that Katama juice. Oh, dried sardines. Oh, oh, oh. Insects can be carnivores too. Yeah, I know, I know. Same thing, just keep feeding her the same thing. Low alcohol beverage. Sure, pretty high ball. Eat, devour. Oh, buff probability at 30%. Business looks good. You two know a thing or two. I did it. Ah, you're here. Today's the date. You haven't forgotten about this, have you? Of course not. I'm all set. Here's 3,000 yen. I almost made like that alone today. Do you see that? <laughs> I made 28... 2,800 yen. Holy shit. Marissa paid up, that's for sure. So we're all clear. Mm, I've indeed received the money. So now the debts between us are settled. Phew. Finally, my kneecaps. Excellent, Misty. This way you can get back to your casual life like before. Well, yeah. And if so, you might not need my help every day. Um, uh, how do I put it? Although I'm happy to have the debt settled... I'm getting used to the daily routine of coming over here and helping out. Me too. You sure were busy days, but they were also happy ones. Yeah. And so it all ends. Don't want it to end? Eh? You're still here. Hey, that's rude! I was here the entire time. Uh, do you want to say anything? I mean, you made it this far in such a short time. Must have been hard. That's for sure. We really gave it our all. Not really. Well, if you're invested so much in your izakaya. Wouldn't it be a pity we just stopped here and went back to square one? It is a pity, but there's no more reason to work this hard, is there? After all, running an izakaya was nothing more than a hobby for me. Now that i pay the debts, I don't need to. Really? Don't you ever have, like, a dream or two? <laughs> dream? What a bird brain. Well, you've been living so long, you've got to have a few regrets. Um, think about it. Is there anything you want to do but can't? Mm, now that you mentioned it, this actually is something like that. We've always wanted to hold a concert of our own in Gensokyo. That's it, that's the one. Huh? You wanna hold a concert, Shane? Well, why don't you do it then? Of course, that's because, because of money, am I right? Um, does it cost money to hold a concert? Of course it does. The stage, the costumes, the lighting, the props, and so on. They're not things you can simply ignore. But, but we're not saying that we have to hold one. That's right, we're happy just singing casually alongside the Yokai Trail. What a bird brain. Well, you don't have to give us our show. It's actually not that hard. But you've already said it takes a lot of money. How can yokai like us get so much money? Don't say that. Look, you still got me. 
Huh? You mean you're willing to sponsor our concert? No, 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 that's absolutely possible. Well then, do you want us to loan us money for the concert? Even if you're a bird, you shouldn't think of reaching the sky in one stride. Then why do you need- why do we need you around? I was just saying that it's better to teach someone a fish than to give them a fish. Although I can't directly help you with a concert, I can help you make a plan for expanding your izakaya business. That way, you'll soon be able to make enough money for a concert. Ah, uh, that sounds like a ton of trouble. We've been working so hard for a month and now we'll have to continue working? Stop it, come on, think about it. You made a business in the state, it's only one month. What will happen if you continue? If we continue, what will happen? Misty? Ah, sorry, I dozed off. Where were we again? Don't doze off on me. I'm delivering the opportunity of a lifetime to you right now. Ask yourself. Do you want to hold an epic, marvelous, and great concert of all time against Tokyo? If we have the opportunity, of course we want to have one. That's true, but... That's great! Uh, I happen to have a mortgage deal that suits you well. How about trying to expand your business and continue running it? This will bring you closer to your dream faster. Um, if I work hard, can I ever expand the one as big as the one in my dream? Dream? Kyoko, I... I want to give it a shot. <sighs> I knew it. Huh? You're misty after all, and this is indeed a rare chance. I'd also like to try. Anyways, whatever your decision is, I will be supporting you. Really? Are you still going to be stay, going to stay by my side? Of course. Ah, do we have an agreement now? So it's a deal now. Oh shit! The contract! Misty Lorelei borrower now owes 6,000 yen to Yakumo Family Bank lender due next month. If borrower defaults, then lender can break borrower's kneecaps. There it is again! All you need to do is shine. Ah, uh, sorry. Handprint, palm print, feather print on this loan agreement. <laughs> and you can leave the, the renovations and construction to us. You have another pre-prepared mortgage agreement ready again. That's just way too suspicious no matter how I look at it. How? How is it suspicious? Ah, that concert does sound nice, doesn't it? I know, I know. I'll sign it. Is this okay? Phew, yeah, that's okay. Well, I won't bother you anymore. <laughs> finally managed to force another mortgage on them again. That master will be pleased, right? But why? What does she want? I can afford that, by the way. Like, I, I can already afford that. Six thousand's nothing. Oh, well then, where do we set up our new place? What's the matter? Um, I was kind of lost when speaking to Chen just now, and you got into this. Speaking of, since your debts are settled, you're not obligated to help me anymore. Do you want me gone? Of course not! There's no problem, then. Should I watch you work alone for our dream while doing nothing myself? But you've already got enough work over at the temple. I know that even though you never mentioned it, the head priest has definitely complained about you working here, right? Uh, how did you... I overheard one of my guests saying so. The temple's work practice involves the start before the ro roosters crow every morning. Besides, because you're an apprentice, you also need to sweep the temple and take care of random stuff. You didn't have much rest to begin with, and ever since you started coming over to me, You've been working both day and night, and the result is that you often doze off when re reciting sutras or sweeping the floor. You've been disciplined by the head priestess quite a few times because of this, right? Some of my guests saw it. I don't want you to be dis disciplined because of me. More importantly, I'm worried that your health would deteriorate if things went on like this. It's nothing. I've gotten used to it. You're lying. Don't you think I don't didn't see it? You're chanting sutras to yourself randomly the past couple days. You're under a lot of pressure, aren't you? But I really do want to reach for our dream together. Hmm. If you want to continue working here, you'll have to reduce your work at the temple. The head priestess wouldn't possibly agree. I don't know. Biakra seems like she'd be kind of chill on those kind of matters. Maybe, possibly, could be. I don't know. What if we changed your work here into work for the temple? Eh? What do you mean? Doesn't the temple often let monks leave to collect alms from elsewhere? If I pay you a commission, shouldn't I be able to make a request to the temple to send you over here at night? You can't do this. You're working hard over here to make money for our dream. But I'm making you pay whenever I come over to help? But with you here, the Izakaya can run more efficiently. I think it's worth it. I understand. Let me go back and negotiate with the head priestess. It's late now. We'll work out a new location for the Izakaya another day. Sure, I'll be heading back as well. Looking forward to seeing you tomorrow. Well, she does only deliver drinks, but she's still on the... She's still, you know, on on the clock for for uh, six hours. Mission. 
I serve meat, but Kyoko does not serve, or not Kyoko. Misty does not serve chicken. So far, anyway. Yeah, look at that revenue. Oh, and tips! Holy shit! <laughs> yeah, wow. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. I made, uh, I basically made the debt today alone. There you go. Yeah, considering the expenses and the debt were all paid off there, that was really good. To the Yokai Trail. Okay. Don't see anything going on here. I I'm doing this. Could make good use of it. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. Okay. Buy some of those. How you doing, Riggle? Riggle, Riggle, what are you doing? There's a big swarm doing here. Don't come here. What? Why? You're a bird after all. I'm afraid you might start drooling with so many cute bugs in front of you, so... Who in the world is going to drool over bugs? I won't. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, alright. Uh, how's my... How's my friendship doing? Riggle is, you know, we're still, we're good buddies. I gotta go talk to Chen. Okay, so Marissa does not like strange things, which is really strange in itself, huh? So that's good to remember. Mushroom and Dew. Sparrow Sake, 10. Okay. Man, I really used all that fancy liquor. And sold it all to Marissa. Gotta remember to check down there every now and again. And now I can talk, yeah, now I can talk to Chen. Chen, have you tried the new dish in my Izakai? How do you like it? New dish. Pork and trout barbecue. Ah, that! Actually, it's pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty rare to get praise from you. Ah, you didn't know, right? I was inspired by... Hey, I forgot to lock the door! I have to get going now. She's so careless. Well, I'll forget it then. Hmm, what do you ask me to do this, eh? Why, why did you show up? Did you find the missing kitty? Nope. Is that so? How do stray cats know to take care of themselves, right? Uh. My kitties came back to the den with lots of goodies recently. Looks like they found a good food source. Uh, where? Wh what? That place belongs to my kitties. Don't you dare steal from them. <laughs> okay. Mm, although it might not be a big deal if I share just a little bit with you. In that case, thank you, Chen. Honey and pork. Nice. What do we got? Egg. I need all your pork. Thank you very much. One beef is fine. I'm kind of okay on tofu. Need all your seafood. Give me all your drink, actually. Just give me all of it. That'll hold my stock for a while. I don't need bamboo shoots. Uh, that's fine for now. Hello, Ruma. Have you ever felt that you weren't taken seriously recently? Just recently? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Venison. No, I kind of want just pork. I might just start using boar meat as my regular. Okay. Doesn't seem like there's much else I can do right now, but I, I'm probably going to gain access to a new area after the today's events. So... I'd like to get some meat from... from Riggle. Yeah. She gives me meat. Honey and cream. Oh, that's unexpected. Okay. I'll get the stuff from, uh... From you know, Rumi as well. Okay. Egg and a pumpkin. I'm gonna invite Chen. Why are you here? I got some fresh ingredients. I thought I might like them. Okay, I'm gonna invite Chen, so Chen will come. I don't see Marissa anywhere, so I can't I can't increase uh, I can't increase anything with her. She's probably in the next area or something. I have no idea, but I want a uh... oh wrong one. I did it again. Uh, shit. 
Thank you, Kraska, for the resub. And yeah, I, I'm fucking addicted to this game. It's really fun. <laughs> I wanted to play it again. Chen, Chen is a little very low, so I want to increase Chen's friendship. But I guess I, I might as well invite Rumia too. Riggle keeps showing up anyways, but I want to make sure that Ruma and Chen show up. Okay. And if I can get one more slab of pork. One more slab of pork. If not, I'll just try to get some lamprey. Okay. Or maybe some Dasai. Oh, yes. Nice, nice, nice. Only one, but that's okay. 130 is good. Alright. Let's open the big shop. Let's take a look at my stuff. I did get some lamprey. Is fried lamprey 27 versus 22? It's not cool. Aquatic greasy and signature, aquatic signature and barbecued. Well, barbecue is good. It's not meat or vegetarian. It's only it's only a five yen difference. It's not a huge difference. Um, I'm gonna put lamprey on the men menu. Uh, rice ball, boiled tofu. Sardines and I'm not putting the pork bowl again. I want to save my pork for a little bit. I'll put the croquet. Okay. All right. Put the usual stuff on the menu and the usual cookware. Okay, and I don't have to give everyone a specific formula. I just need to give them food they like to increase their friendship. Should be okay to go. Okay. Misty, Misty! Kyoko, did the head priestess agree to let you come over? Yes, the head priestess said that you can never ascend... Said you can never ascend to Buddhahood if you allow private matters to delay your practice. But if they were a part of your practice, then it's fine. Oh, okay. I, I thought for a second there, Biakra then was saying some mean shit. <laughs> that feels a bit crafty. But it's good that she agreed. Now we can work together again. Uh, and the head priestess said the commission fee should be 5% of the total revenue. 5%?! N no problem. All right, if that's so, I can start sweeping the temple at later times in the future. Huh? You still have to do the sweeping? Of course, waking up early, receiving sutras, and sweeping are my morning practices. But the head priest has said I'm allowed to doze off. I could kind of see why people are big shots while we are small fry. <laughs> it's almost time. Let's open the izakaya. Sunday for tomorrow. If you need my help, just hire me before you open. Oh, I got to remember that. Been helping for a while now, and I should be able to perform additional tasks. Oh, that'd be so nice. Listen, it may not seem like she's doing much, but I am not paying attention to the drink menu at all. I am leaving that 100% to Kyoko. If you made, if you, if you left me to handle that on top of all the food, I will actually just fucking pop. <laughs> My brain will pop. You can assign me to different jobs later. No, I like, I like you on the drinks one. Drink server is fine. It, it. it I don't have to worry about an entire sub menu. Okay. 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 Whoosh. Okay, I got my backups. Okay, that's my backup. Okay. There we go. I'm already on hyper mode.
Okay. Hmm. Oh, that wolf girl's back. I want sweet cuisine and iceable beverage. Sweet, huh? What do I have that's sweet? I don't have a. I don't have anything for that. Sweet. I don't have butter. I can make that. That's sweet. That's sweet and dreamy. That covers a lot alone. But does she want that? Sweet meat dreamy. Uh, sweet. I should just give her this. Cutting board, do tofu, egg, honey. Okay. Western sweet photogenic cool. Sure. Alright. And iceable beverage. Oh, I have a Desai. I have one to decide for that. There's Ruma. Okay. Okay. Precious way to eat something raw, I want to eat it raw. What a room I like again. Filling meat raw. Okay. This is filling. Raw meat. Did she like strange? She did. Okay. Filling strange meat raw. And drink soda beverage. Soda beverage. Sweet cuisine and a sweet beverage. Tofu, honey, do. Can you add meat to that? Fuck, that's weird. <laughs> and a sweet beverage. It's a neat beverage. We'll do that. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, bye Ruma. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh shit. Dark matter. <laughs> oh, I don't have the... I have that though. Aquatic cuisine and an iceable beverage. Aquatic with uh you like sweet, right? Sweet meat. Sweet meat and aquatic. Aquatic meat sweet. Yep. Iceable beverage. Okay. 
nice. That's weird. What you want? Fish, fish and a dry beverage. She likes uh, aquatic barbecue, greasy, sweet, and meat. Aquatic barbecue, greasy, sweet, and meat. Well, she likes the pork and tuna then, right? Because it's aquatic, barbecued, meat. Put some honey on that. That's a Chen favor right there. And a dry beverage. Do I have sardines and, nope. A dry beverage. Okay. Uh oh. Okay. Uh, what you want? Fish and a dry beverage. Okay. Fish and a dry beverage. Uh, so let's go with the... Low alcohol. Why is Marissa in line? Marissa, you're too late! Weird one. Give her a weird one. Okay. No! <laughs> meat. Sweet raw meat. Okay. Closing time. Bye, Marissa. Come back soon. Man, it sucks when they get in line that late. I want roast meat skewered on a stick. I know exactly what you want. It's the same thing I've given you every time. Okay. Nobody wanted the tofu. Uh. Fruity beverage. Okay. Low alcohol beverage. Okay. Low alcohol beverage. What else you want? The weird one. Oh, it's gonna be the weird one again. I'm running out of cicada stuff. Sweet raw meat. Okay. And then pork. Trout, sweet, for Chen. Hiya! Hoi! 
She gave me more lamprey. Chen's still not done. Okay. You can't grow without eating meat in a dry beverage. Just keep those skewers coming, I suppose. I'm running low on honey. Uh-oh. Dry beverage. Whoosh! Yummy, yummy. <laughs> Again? Same deal, all right. A dry beverage. No, fruity beverage. Whoosh. You done? I, I'm glad that Chen is just giving me a bunch of free shit. That's great. Thanks, Chen. Bye. Extra resource gathering probability. Obtain permit for the human village. Ooh, new location. Ooh. Appreciate your hard work today as well, Misty. You can leave the cleaning to me. Thanks. I'll leave it to you then. You're welcome. Hmm, but I'm also getting used to this now. <laughs> Thinking back to the time when we expanded, that was a real fuss. Yeah, it was quite nerve-wracking seeing the Izakaya with more guests after the expansion. The good news is that this region isn't really heavily populated. And the customers are all familiar faces, so it doesn't take long to cope with it. Mmm, speaking of which, what is it? I was thinking that now that we've decided to expand the Izakaya, but we're still staying on the Yokai Trail, isn't this counterintuitive? You want to leave this place? Well, yeah, a little bit. But where can we go if you want to leave? Stronger Yokai roam the entire Gensokyo. It's already hard enough for weak little yokai like us to gain a footing at the yokai trail. You're right, I haven't thought it thur th throughly. Throughly? Yet? Reimu! Huh? A guest at this hour? Dear guests, we're terribly sorry, but we're closed for tonight. Please come back tomorrow. <laughs> Miss Reimu? Did you freeze in place just by seeing me? Sorry, I instinctively... Uh, are you here for food? But at this hour... Uh, we're... I'm not here to eat anything. Say, even if I didn't do anything, you can't just go on and about assuming that you can do any everything. Huh? We didn't do anything bad. I think? And you say you didn't do anything. Look at your izakaya! What in the world are you doing? I'm making food. But the izakaya... There's nothing wrong with it? There's nothing wrong with it? You used to pull a stall cart. I tolerated that. Now you set up a decent place like this at the end of the Yokai Trail without even notifying me. Why do I have to notify you? Uh, uh, thanks for the praise? I'm not praising you. You're expanding your business so recklessly. Do you even have a permit? Per meat? Kyoko, do you know what that is? I have no idea. What do we need this, what, whatever thing for our business? It's useless talking to you halfwits. Just close down your izakaya. Ah, we are closed. I mean, like, never open again. <laughs> what? We followed all the rules running our business. Not even the Hakure Miko could, could simply chase us away like this. Don't I mean, you have any idea what kind of place the Yokai Trail is? Setting up a restaurant here and attracting a crowd here, you'll create troubles eventually. All in all, no business can operate on the Yokai Trail. All businesses that open up here are to be shut down. That This is a rule of Gensokyo. If you put it like this... Would it then be okay if we moved our izakaya somewhere else? Eh. Um, it's not like anywhere other than the Yokai Trail would work. However, if it's somewhere like the human village, at least there will be no danger for humans. But that's actually a pretty dangerous place for us Yokai. If you could get that person's support, even you should be accepted by humans. That person? She's the one who acts as if she's handling Miko duty in the human village. Instead of trusting a 100% genuine human like myself, the village places more trust in that one. They are just... So who is she? It's Kane, you moron. Miss Reimu, we don't often set foot in the human village. There's no way we are familiar with such an important figure of the village. Don't often set foot? Does that mean there were instances where you, you sneaking into the village? N not really. Only once in a while. Hey, we aren't talking about that person. Are, mm, who is she again? Hmm. She is a half wear beast despite being a yokai. She's also the teacher for human children. What? What? Are humans willing to have yokai educate their young? Hey, I'm not here to casually chat with you. 
Whatever you do, shut down your place here. I'm willing to set up my izakaya in the human village. Eh? However, I can't give up this place either. Who cares what you want? Damn! What <laughs> Raymond, what the fuck? Miss Raymond, you used to visit here occasionally as a guest. It's pretty close to your shrine from here. Isn't that convenient for you? If we really close the izakaya for good, then you might lose some potential visitors. Hmm. <laughs> Even if so, I wouldn't simply... I promise you that I'll get the izakaya running in the human village, which also means I'll be opening less frequently here. Pretty please, I promise that I'll keep a low profile from now on. Hmm. Ah, whatever. I'll let you off the hook this time, as long as you can promise that you won't cause any troubles. Yes, I promise. Fine. It's quite late now, and I'm not like you, yokai. I'm going back to get some sleep. You must get permission from that person tomorrow. You can't open your izakaya without a permit at the yokai trail next month. Watch your steps on the way back, Miss Reimu. Damn, Reimu. Misty, are you really going to move our izakaya to the human village? You should know this, but you have been considering places with more traffic than the Yokai Trail for a while now. But that's the human village. Well, Miss Raymu said it's okay, so I just wanted to try it out. Can I, Kyoko? Okay, you win. Alright then, if you really want to try, then I'll give you my support. Thank you, you're such a good friend. <laughs> but it would cost a small fortune to open up a new branch at the human village. Ah, I forgot about that. It seems like we have to find her again. And we'll be in debt again. By the way, I think the Miko also told us to get somebody's permission. So that the villagers wouldn't discriminate against us just because we are yokai. No idea who it might be. Let's go to the human village tomorrow and find out. Oh, hey, Raymu, what's up? Close this establishment now. Bye, Raymu. Bye, Raymu. <laughs> wow, look at, the, look at the menu that I served today. Jesus that that uh that meat and trout skewer goes like hits like all of uh all of the, t the tags for Chen the cicada shells works well uh for for wriggle as well and Ruma Ruma, Ruma I don't know I just put an egg on things and Ruma likes it I guess <laughs> hmm I'll make another save just in case. You put a raw egg on it, it becomes a raw dish. Finally unlock the new location. Pressing this button brings up the map so you can see the new locations. Now you can fast travel between the human village and the yokai trail. No need to walk, I'll fly there in an instant. Every flight between neighboring locations takes 30 minutes, however, it doesn't take any time to fast travel. If the destination is the same location as the starting location, make good use of this. Now let's see. Who still has another flightless bird? Oh god, uh, what's new? Today's 117, right? Surely. Home cooked foods are popular. It's commercial season while traveling around, home cooked foods are always memorable. The Night Sparrow Izakaya, dead or alive, the Hakurade Shrine made him visit the unlicensed Izakaya to fill her duty. What fate awaits the Izakaya? Okay. I don't really want to fast travel. A boat flying. You can fast travel to different locations on the map. So jealous that you have wings. All you need to do is press... Ah! Keyboard M, controller X. And you'll be able to see the map. Select the destination to go there in no time. And no, and no time in real life. It'll still take 30 minutes in-game minutes between every adjacent location. I almost forgot. If you're fast traveling to your current location, you can just reset your position. Doing so would not cost you any in-game time. That's convenient. How's it going, Wriggle? Bug business. Second thought. Okay. Let's see. No sparrow sake. I'll check it out in a second, but let me just look around first. I need some more honey. I'm running low on honey. Hmm. Talk to Chen. And the merchant as well. Picked up two pretty flowers just now. I'll give you one. Which color do you like? Aren't they the same color? Ah? Uh, this one is orange and this one is yellow. Does that mean... Mean... Means what? What's the color of your dress? Is... Is it not the same color? Ah. Uh, 
I once heard that cats can't distinguish reddish co reddish colors. It might actually be true. <laughs> oh god, you can tell. Don't need any beef. I'm okay on that. Potatoes are fine. That's fine. Get all the seaweed. That's 25 of each. It's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Gates down. I know why the grass is dying here, Ruma. Okay. Well, I'm definitely gonna go to the new area first and foremost. Uh, let's see though. Almost at high bond level. Maybe I'll run into Marissa over this way. Travel to the human village. Hello. As the man of the house, I have the shoulder of responsibilities. Can I just take these? I guess so. I probably shouldn't. Oh, we got new music. Oh, it's Kassen! Sages that do not completely surrender their mortal desires cannot enter heaven. Most sages live as hermits hiding somewhere in this world. Hello, Miss Kassen. Oh, hello. Hmm. Are you that... That night sparrow who sang on stage at the last Harkaday Shrine Party? Yes. We have met several other Harkaday Shrine Parties as well. Hmm. <clears throat> However, I do believe this is the first time we met each other at the human village. While I might be a hypocrite for saying this, I still believe that a yokai shouldn't wander around the human village in broad daylight. Don't worry, the humans here at the village know me already. Really? Well, from a human's perspective, it does look like they have tried your best to assimilate into human society. In that case, I have no reason to exterminate you. However, you better make sure you don't cause any ruckus around here. If you do, I won't sit idle. Wah, well, I understand. New friend. Mysterious sage with a long face. Pretty sure she's somehow different from other sages. Well, just a feeling though. I have never met any other sage before. There she is. Her budget's the same as Chen, huh? Alright. Welcome! This is an antique shop. Please let me know if you see anything that catches your eyes. He sells mushrooms. And tofu. Oh, he sells kitchenware! What's this? Recipes. I don't have extra currency. What is that? Christmas suit, Tang Spirit Festival, Halloween special costume. I don't have that. I don't have frog coins. It's almost impossible. It's kind of I'd be in the future. Don't regret it if you missed it. Maybe you were absolutely right. This is exactly what you needed right now. No. What? I don't. I don't have frog coins. Nobody likes frog coins. They're fucking annoying. Ah! I do have rocks. I do have rocks, yeah. He can't- he doesn't have any kitchen more. I have cool rocks, I don't have cool frog coins though. Frog fuchsius. <gasps> ah, cute! Listening to the orchestral music while sipping some black tea is my most favorite enjoyable time of the day. Miss Lorelai, how do you do? The- the mistress of the Hieda family. Greetings! Ah, oh, this is the first time I've been called that. I've always wanted to visit your Hezekiah as soon as you opened at the Yokai Trail. Unfortunately, I'm not feeling too well recently, so I never found an appropriate opportunity. <clears throat> I can't believe you already have another branch here at the Human Village. I heard rumors that Miss Aku has poor health. Looks like it's real. Don't worry about the interviews. You can interview me as much as you want once you feel better. Thank you so much for understanding. Aku. The head of the noble Hiede family in the human village. He's also the author of Gensokyo Chronicle. Alright. It seems like Rinosuke doesn't show up, huh? Oh, well, he's... Wait, he's there. He's a special guest. He claims he's just an ordinary merchant, but he really doesn't know how to run a business. Uh, he frequently out of stock. The price is almost entirely arbitrary. That said, there's a chance I can find something useful from his store. Okay. Another merchant. Homegrown. Excellent prices. Some eggs. Give me your pork. Thank you. Take your chili peppers. I'll take all your seaweed. 
Thank you. <gasps> Hello, Ringo. I ate more dongos than everybody in the village ate rice. Lunar dongo, special ante mochi. They taste like moonlight because they are made with moonlight, rare moonlight grass. That's not a recipe. And then she sells the soda ball. Hmm. Damn it, that bastard's already won when it comes to her ability. This is practically cheating. Just raw mochi. He needs some milk and grapefruit juice. Neat. Buy milk or grapefruit juice. Supposedly you're probably drinking the outside world extracted from red grapefruit. It's cool and refreshing, leaving to after aftertaste. Perfect for hot nights. Give me some milk. It costs 14. Kind of pricey, huh? For an ingredient. Japanese sweet small portion. It's like a whole ass food item. Alright. Take a look around town. There's a dragon statue. Alas! Yo, the who I'm in female too. My husband never cleans the dishes after meals. Why is every man like this? Hmm. Why does my husband constantly toss his clothes and socks everywhere? Hmm, <laughs> even if you ask me. I heard that the outside world is a machine that can wash clothes. I look forward to the day when Gen Sokyo has it. My husband never showers before bed. Come on, I just changed the bed sheets. Hmm. I, 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 jeez. Sensei's class is too boring, so I skipped it. That's probably not good. If you really ask for it, it's not like I won't share my stuff with him, idiot. Just say it. <laughs> Actually, I really am afraid of skipping classes. However, I'm more afraid of Cole getting into serious trouble while skipping class. Koa's not too good at expressing herself. She doesn't have many friends at school. If I don't accompany her, she'll appear to be very lonely. What? You see that golden tree back there? Hold on, I'm not done looking around town. Misty Lake seems to be foggy in the morning. I wonder what's in there. There's a fishing spot. Okay. Dun 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 dun. That's where, my, that's where my stand's gonna go. You have wine and drink today, leave tomorrow's worries and sorrow behind. Zun Beer, the product of side hustle of a great figure who is deeply connected to Gensokyo. Surprisingly popular. Sengetsuse. With the blessing of three fairies, the sake has become a popular choice at Izakai's mid alcohol, smooth taste, and an affordable price. No wonder why. Give me that beer. Why not? I don't really sell much in the way of that anyway. In fact, not only can we bring prosperity, we also have the ability to predict the future! Wow. Can go nut! Okay. I don't see anything else. Oh, I'm stealing this. <laughs> Alright. The egg robber. I don't see anything else. The classroom feedback was not too good today. I need to review my revise my lectures when I head back. This person. Map unlocked? Map unlocked. Oh, Jesus. I think I've seen her somewhere before. Although I don't think I know her well. Whatever. I better keep a low profile here in the human village. What is your manners? Did you forget how to say hello? Huh? Were you talking to me? Hmm. Hmm. <clears throat> Don't you remember me? We met each other before the Eternal Night Incident. Kind of remember now. Are you that Hakutaku? That's right. Do forgive me for calling out to you, but... Excuse me, where did you get this ginkgo leaf? Uh, from right behind you. What? How did you know I was carrying a ginkgo leaf? It, Kane, turn around. May I see it? Sure, of course. Here you go. Isn't it a pretty leaf? T t t turn around! <laughs> As expected, this power of mine. But why would you have a token that carries my power? What are you talking about? Are you trying to take my leaf away? Please don't be alarmed. It's not my intention. I'll return to its proper owner right now. 
Well, it's not like I'm stingy or anything like that. It's just that I feel like this leaf is very important, which is why I... Do you remember where you found this leaf? I don't remember. Never mind, we'll figure it out someday. But by the way, I think I've seen you before somewhere else. Didn't I just tell you? We met each other during the Eternal Night incident. Did they? Uh, is that so? You feel kind of different. You would have seen my Hakutaku form back then, I think. The appearance you're seeing now is my human form. Eh? Please excuse me for not properly introducing myself. My name is Kane Kamishirasawa, and I'm half human, half Hakutaku. So you're a were beast. That's convenient. And that's why you can walk around in the human village without a disguise despite being a yokai. There are actually quite a few yokai living in disguise inside the village. However... The reason I'm here is because I must teach and educate the children. <laughs> this is a good shot. I like this one. <laughs> huh? Is that so? Does that mean you're the person who is handling Miko duty in the village? I don't really like that title. But due to the laziness of that Miko, I did take over her Miko jobs over here. Actually, I have a favor to ask you. Kane sensei please help me. As you've just said, it's been quite a few yokai living in the... There are quite a few yokai living in the village. Then may I open my izakai in the village? Mm, you may. Just don't be too conspicuous. Especially, no alcohol for minors. That's great news. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And... Mm, whatever it is, please go ahead. And the next time you see me, remember to greet me properly. Yes, Kane sensei So I'll open the izakai at the yokai trail one last time today, and tomorrow I'll move to the new world. Hey, I think it could all go well. Something bothering you? Why not... Classroom feedback... Uh, I want to talk about related tasks. Pay 6,000 by the deadline. I can do that pretty easily. Wait, it said I can go... I unlock new areas, right? Um... Oh, it's DLC. Oh. I'm, I don't want to go in the DLC areas. To be honest with you. Like, I have them. I know I have them, but I... I, I kind of want to... I kind of want to play the vanilla game. First and foremost. I don't really want to... I don't really want to dive into the extra content. Besides, I don't know if the extra content is anticipating me to do that, like, be- Oh, shit. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's not good. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna leave him alone. <laughs> Bad game. No! So... I guess I can see what I can find here. I can find tuna here. I can't find lamprey in the village. Uh, to be honest, I'd rather go back. I'd rather go back and, uh... What do you call it? Get some more, uh, more honey and, and fish and stuff. DLC does assume you- okay, okay. That's why I, I figured as much. So I will- I will maintain my distance from that. <clears throat> okay. In the grass. Okay, well, I can get some... Chili. Those are onions. 20 onions. 20 radish. 20... 40 pumpkins! Oh my Jesus! Mistia, you can't just take 40 pumpkins! <laughs> what are you gonna do with all those pumpkins? <laughs> Alright. They're mine now. Absolutely jacked. Alright, let's start pulling things off trees for honey. How's she carrying them out? Okay, sparrow sake. So I gotta run one more establishment here. Right here at the spot. Some honey. What's my stuff looking like right now? Pork's okay. I would like more lamprey. 
I like honey because it's a very effective ingredient for adding sweet to things. Hmm. I'll take that, that's fine. <laughs> Lex Luthor style, yeah. 40, 40 pumpkins. Nobody could stop me. Okay. Okay. Select partners. Oh, I forgot to hire Mystia! She's an honest and optimistic Yamabiko yokai. Uh, repeats what I said that they live in the mountain valley since ancient times. They're the end of the temple because they're disappointed the humans can increase the more scientific. Okay. 5% of daily revenue goes towards her. So, assistant cook. Assistant cook and cook normal guest orders and put the finished food into the food storage container. The waitress can take out food from the food storage and deliver it to the corresponding guests. And the drink server can take the drinks from the wine rack and deliver it to the corresponding guests. Okay, so she can either cook the food and put it in storage for me, and I do the deliveries. Uh, she can do the deliveries of the food from the food cart, or she can do the drink bar. Honestly, I'm okay with her staying on the drink bar. Yeah, drink server Kyoko. Um... Yeah, seems good to me. And she gets 5%. 5% of the revenue. Alright. Let's see what's happening here. Oh, man. I'm taking Lamprey off the menu. Let's get the boiled tofu. Nobody wants it. Rice ball. Nobody wants it. Sardines. Some people want it. Uh... Okay. <laughs> and runny egg. Oh my god. And put the usual stuff on the menu, I suppose. Yeah, that's fine with me. <laughs> I can't wait to cook a million rice balls again. Nobody wants the fucking runny egg, dude. Alright. Have you made up your mind yet? We've decided to open our izakaya in the, in the village. I'll leave the rest to you then. It'll be smooth. Leave it all to me. I'll get going right now and work out the project for you. You can trust the construction team. No, Chen, come back. You need to eat dinner. We need to bond over food. Gingo nut. Photogenic. What? Oh my god. I don't want influencers to show up, take pictures. Truffle. Wow. Cream. Wow. Crap! Wow. Okay. Now I have to start paying her. I'm prepared for the worst. Maybe Rainbow will visit. I am shocked. Shocked that you want this. All right. Just what I needed. What you want, what you want. I got one of everything in there except the runny egg. Nobody ever buys the runny egg. I, wow, all right, sure. Wow, okay, all right. There you go. I'm impressed. People want the potato. They love it. There's Chen. Negotiations must have went by fast. Huh. 
dried sardines. Oh god. How could you bring up the taste without oil and a fruity beverage? Alright. Table one. Hyper mode. Fruity beverage. And Chen will give her the the classic. The sweet pork and trout kebab. Chen likes popular kind of food. Hold on. She didn't really like that one. Oh. That's weird. Oh, I... No, I put... It was aquatic... I don't know, she didn't love that one, but her bond level maxed out, so it's okay. But I kind of wanted the bonus. Alright. Oh. Okay. There's backup. Nice. Man, they really like it today. My food has just improved. They love me! Is that Riggle? Oh no. I wouldn't say Riggle invites disaster. Oh. But she definitely invites a lot of people. Meat tastes better when it's cooked raw. Low alcohol beverage. Strange, sweet, raw meat. Low alcohol. Low alcohol. Low alcohol. Oh shit! Why are croquet so they're so they're so popular right now? Oh hello, Ruma. All right, take it and get. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Specialty dishes and a soda beverage. Uh, specialty? I do have a specialty. And meat. The lamprey, right? Hold on, what doesn't she like? I don't actually know. But. She likes sweet. Strange filling meat raw. Strange filling meat raw. Raw, strange, meat, and signature. Soda beverage. Specialty, same thing, same thing, same thing. Raw, strange, 
Meat, lamprey. Sort of average. Okay. Why all? Aquatic cuisine and an iceable beverage. Aquatic. Oh. The hell do you like again? Uh, aquatic sweet meat. Aquatic sweet meat. Yeah. Iceable beverage. Do I have a Desai? I don't. Uh. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Good. Good, 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 good. Oh. Slow down. Creamy cuisine. Uh, dry beverage. That's it. Dreamy cuisine. Dreamy cuisine. Dreamy cuisine. What was that again? No. Uh... Do honey egg meat? No, not that. Do honey ah oh, tofu. There we go. And sweet photogenic dreamy. And stick some meat in there because that makes sense. Price ball. Yeah. Hiya. It's so nice to see me be able to sell fried potatoes today. Putting them on the menu for so long and nobody ever wanted them, dude. No matter what I did, nobody wanted them. Oh. You again. Meat cuisine and a sweet beverage. A sweet beverage, okay. And a meat cuisine. How about some... I don't have that. Dream. Do I have dreamy? Do I have dreamy and meaty? Uh... It's not dreamy. It's meaty. The ramen. It's popular right now. Uh, boiling pot. And she likes uh, sweet, right? Who doesn't like sweet? Yeah, sweet. Boiling pot. Uh, tonkatsu ramen. Okay, and I can add some honey to it, make it sweet. Okay. Don't have any more backup. Nice. 
Hope you like this. Perfect. There she goes. There's my money. Bank has been made. Nice. Maximum recipes to six. Mission begin. Level up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Good God. After that, I assume you'll be moving to the human village to open Yuzhikaya there. Huh? Of course. Remember to come back to the Yokai Trail once in a while. Although your food's just show show. Hmm. It's better than nothing. Sure thing. Chen, I'll work hard to come up with more fish dishes. Hmm. Well, the thing is, I don't know if uh, my friends are going to visit unless they're, they're I'm at a certain spot. But I want to max out my friendship with, with the people at the trail, right? Well, that went really well. Hmm. You know, I don't think I've ever had a potato dish I haven't liked. I've never had a deep fried potato, though. Well, I guess it's not deep fried, huh? <laughs> it's just fried potato. People's Welfare, free vegetable pickling program. Some residents of the village are willing to offer fruit and vegetable pickling for free. Uh, the unlicensed Izakai is branched of the human village. The nightlife of residents will be even more colorful henceforth. I'm a fan of the author Agatha Chris Q. I'm willing to buy anything related to her rich reward. Come find me if you are sincere. Miss Aku's wish. I see. Okay. Well, I'm not... I, I meant... I, I wasn't talking about french fries, I was talking about croquets. So the frying pan. But when I think of like, things like that, I think of karage, which is... Just chicken, but deep fried twice. They deep fry it, and they deep fry it again. Like... That sounds- that sounds American, if you ask me. That's the- that's- that's- that sounds American. Uh, nope. <laughs> nope. Not American. Okay, let's see. Tasks. Uh, this is a small yet energy. Give four and three thousand. And then unlock human village cabin shrine cart. Wow, that's a lot of money you want from me right now. Hold on. Okay. Hmm. Okay, let me take a look around real quick. First, let's get uh, let's get the friendship engaged. Actually, you first. Uh, eggs are fine. Can never have enough pork. Okay. That's good. Okay, talk to me, Chen. You got new injuries. Got scratched by stray cats again? <laughs> you are their leader, aren't you? It's because they have bad temperament. <clears throat> Did you find the missing cat we mentioned last night? Is that kitty- It's that kitty who scratched me. And here he still got away in the end. Uh, did you- Something that makes him hate you. I- Don't know either. It looks like you're feeling really troubled by it. This kitty might cause trouble alone- Alone outside. How old is he? About four years old? That's not a kitty anymore! It's normal for an adult cat to leave the den and form their own colony, right? Eh! Is it normal? That's part of nature. You can't grow without being independent. Mm, but there are adults who want to stay at home all the time, right? For example, there are adults who want to stay at home forever because dinner at home is just too delicious. You can't apply human principles to cats. On a separate note, I have to admit that your cooking talents are very good. Huh? Me? You gave me the recipe for the new dish. I only improved the recipe a little. Hmm? When? You don't remember? That's kind of expected. You were very dizzy then. Then... Then we should be able to keep everyone in the den with super delicious dishes, right? I've already told you this is not the problem. <laughs> Does this mean we need to make something even better? <sighs> Fine, I'll help you this time. Eh? You can make dishes so delicious that you can keep kitties from leaving? We, not you, tell me what you know about those cats and let's develop a recipe that every cat loves. Okay, just... Just as once, I beg you, please help me. You know what those cats like to eat? Do they find something new recently? They've been going near the river and scooping something up. Is it fish? It's something longer and softer. I'm not sure either. Because I'm really weak against water, my master forbids me from going near rivers. Hmm, what could it be from the river? Could it be seaweed? Seaweed? Now that you mention it, it kind of looked like that. Let's try to make some dishes with seaweed. Stray Cats Part 2. I brought some dishes with seaweed. Give them a try. 
It feels nothing out of the ordinary. How come? Is it because I didn't control the heat correctly? It's not about taste. Maybe too vegetarian. Then should I add some meat? I wonder what meat is best for cats. Stray cats need a lot of calories to survive in the wild. It'd be great if they could eat something more nutritious. They're stray cats after all. In that case, how about boar meat? Seaweed and boar meat? <laughs> come out of that combination. You never know until you try. I'll bring the ingredients here. Power soup. Is this recipe really okay? I feel like I won't like the taste. Really? I thought it would turn out pretty good. Then let's give it a try. Okay, I'll try my best to adjust the flavor until you like it. Mm, what are you asking me to do, eh? Huh? When did you show up? Did you find the missing kitty? Uh, have Chen try out power soup. My kitties have been hungry for grilled fish. Deliver to Chen. Four aquatic small portion. Four aquatic. I guess I should just do that, huh? Well, first of all, I'm here to talk. I'm gonna talk to Ruma. Okay. Let's see. Ruma's okay. Well, Ruma won't have a quest for me yet. Okay, I gotta remember to go talk to them. Haven't found Marissa yet. She hasn't shown up anywhere. Bore me. Okay. Gotta spend money to make money. So I need aquatic dishes. I will be allowed to do this, right? Um... Give four cuisines of aquatic of small portion to Chen. Oh, I see. I didn't even take that much time. And four cuisines aquatic and barbecued. Okay. Hmm. I'm coming, Chen. Related tasks. Human branch expansion and the yokai branch expansion. So let's do this first, I suppose. Okay. Okay. Nice. Kind of small but full of energy. It's like your izakaya. So according to our contract, I'll help you expand your izakaya. Remember to work hard and pay me back, okay? <laughs> ho ho, everybody! Want to eat a grilled fish and have a little sparrow can get them. This izakaya is pretty big. Do your best, okay? So now I unlocked... I think I unlocked tier 3 and tier 2 for the human village, respectively. It costs a lot of money. And now I just need, need 6,000 for the debt at the end. I need to get Chen to try the power soup, which uses boar meat and seaweed. Oh, Ruma's quest, nice. Dark Matter Part 1. That's a lot of money, yeah. Ruma, am I seeing you in my izakaya more and more recently? That's because Misty's food is tasty. Thank you, that's partly thanks to you as well. I still can't believe I forgot my signature dish. Thanks for the reminder again. Maybe that's what they mean by being so used to a thing's existence that you forget it was even there. Is that so? Yes, by the way, do you know that lampreys are actually the ingredient that best matches my ability? I can make people have temporary night blindness and lampreys can cure that. We're just like a match made in heaven. A night sparrow is a match made in heaven with lampreys? You should have one too. An ingredient that best matches your ability. I don't know. You are known as the yokai of dusk after all. Close. <laughs> you definitely know something about foods that are black, right? You mentioned that you stayed at this black food festival before, right? I have no idea about foods at all. Yeah, that sounds about right. However, I remember something recently. I ran into a black bear several days ago because it's pretty rare seeing a black bear around here. So I wanted to eat it. B black bear. Your appetite is surprisingly big even when you look like a little girl. <laughs> is that so? However, even as a yokai, we shouldn't treat rare animals as food. Many a certain sage will show up out of nowhere and start lecturing you. I didn't eat that bear. I was kind of worried something that would, like that would happen. So I stopped for a moment. And that black bear just took the opportunity and ran away. I still regret letting it escape like that. Hmm. I see. Maybe I can substitute that black bear with something else. Can you actually do it? Hmm, let me think. Something similar to a black bear. Iberico 
Iberico pork. Is that so? Hmm, <laughs> maybe? Don't go away, I'll find one and show it to you. This is it? What should I do with it? Mm, boil it or grill it? It feels like something is missing. Do you have any ideas? Meat tastes pretty much the same. Saying that like it's declaring war on cooks. Is that so? Hmm, <laughs> wait a moment. What's wrong? You said meat tastes pretty much the same. I was wondering, maybe it's because you had too much meat? In that case, why not just combine meat with vegetables? Eh? I don't want to eat veggies. Oh, come on, drama queen. Even carnivores occasionally eat a little veggies. I'm not a carnivore. I'm a yokai. <laughs> is that scary? Not scary at all. Your face is round and squishy. It's quite cute, actually. As cute as a pufferfish? Are pufferfish cute? I mean, they definitely taste good. Hmm, speaking of that, I once visited a country before. You did what? Jeez, how many places have you visited before? The people there treat a puffy black and white bear as a, their treasure. Bear. People there must be really brave. That bear doesn't actually eat humans, or I should say it doesn't like to eat meat. Then that bear is the exact opposite of you. What does it eat then? Bamboo. I've never tried it before. Eh, are you interested? Hmm, just wait here, I'll find some for you. Wait, you want me to find... Give a- Oh no, a bamboo shoot! No, you bitch! I hope the other market's selling it. I hope the other market's selling it. <sighs> Can't imagine what Genzaki would look like in the future. You have a feeling that both humans and yokai are going to flourish. Miss Heida, if you don't feel well, why don't you why don't you stay in bed and rest? It's actually very tiring laying in bed all day. We have lovely weather out here, and it's good for my health to come out of some fresh air. The air in the village is not as damp as the air at the Yokai Trail. It smells like sunshine. It's indeed quite comforting. Please sell me a bamboo shoot. Wait, what's that? Compared to Yokai, wild animals are more scary against Sokyo nowadays. I feel kind of weird about that statement. I, I thought that was a rock. No! Well, I'm buying your seaweed and your chili peppers. Can never have enough. Can never have enough food. Ringo, sell me a bamboo shoot. Hmm. Buy all your milk. Looking for the taskmaster here. Classroom feedback was not good today. Hey, Sensei, hello. Hello! Hmm, what's the matter? Last time I taught, I saw my students waving a strange-looking big feather. Now that I see it, is that feather from your wing? Those were your students all along? Please tell them to stop picking my feathers in the future. At this rate, I'll be, feather I'll be a featherless chicken. I'm so sorry, I will scold them immediately. Some egg. Nice. Some poor egg. Some gingo. You sell drinks. Buy more Sengetsu, say. Some more beer. I gotta talk to Kasen, and I gotta find the person who wants to talk about Agatha Chris Q. I probably don't see Kozuzu anywhere. Mm -mm. Hmm. Huh. It's a big map. There they are. Oh, says it was Hermit's sighting. Somewhere in the world, Mr. Xen, are you going somewhere? That's right, I'm heading to the shrine. You mean the Hakure shrine? Something happened there. Not really, I'm just heading there to check if Reimu is still training hard. Mr. Xen, you really care about Miss Reimu, don't you? The current Hakure Miko leaves a lazy and snobbish impression to others. I can't let that reputation slide. Really? Thank you for your hard work. Looks like Miss Xen gave Reimu a rough time. I am a super fan of Agatha Chris Q. If you can find anything, and I mean anything from her, please give it to me. I'll make it so you're worth your while. That's just bamboo. Wait! Wait, wait, he's selling! He's selling! Yes! Thank you. Ice cube. Oh, lamprey? Give me that. Honey, give me that. 
Whoa. 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 Kitchenware. Whoa. That costs... That costs rocks. This costs one frying pan for a super pan. This costs a super pan and seven... Oh, jeez. He's got stuff, though. He's got stuff. An extra cutting board is nice. Cuisine that takes 25% longer to cook. Cuisine made during hyper mode ignores rare customers' orders. Instead, rare guests will review based on their own preference. Only Misty can activate this effect. Wait, what? What does that mean? It takes longer to cook and made by hyper mode ignore rare customers' orders. And rare guests will review based on their own preference. Isn't that what they already do? Wait a minute, what? I, I I thought that's what they already do. It costs seven rocks. Is that good? I don't know if that's good. What the fuck are these? Disc Human 3. O OST. Oh. Okay. Hmm. I'm not tied to the specific thing they ask for. Oh, so it means I can hit any of their preferences, not just the one they ask me for, but... But why wouldn't I hit the preference they asked me for and then stick the extra stuff on it anyway, right? If they ask for a quality, you can just give them meat. Oh, I see. Well, I mean, that's neat and all, but... I don't know, that seems kind of... Pointless. Increased chance... I see, okay. An increased chance to buy, uh... For a super cutting board, that's expensive. 5% faster, guests are now 3% more likely to order. I could use another cutting board. <laughs> Give me that super cutting board, dog. All right. Give three to signed washi. Give three what? What? Huh? Okay. I gotta. I, I'll take it. That's how. That's a hefty investment. But I use the cutting board a lot for stuff. Hello, owner of the Izakaya. I saw the newspaper that you needed help. Could you tell me more? Okay, so one of my husband's acquaintances is coming to visit in the coming days. My husband told me that his friend is a soma uh, sommelier. Oh God, what's I? I know this word, but I can't remember how to pronounce it. Unfortunately, I'm not a drinker myself, so I don't know what to drink to give him when he comes. You asked the right person. Quite experienced, all kinds of alcohol. That's great, however, the alcohol content is too high, and they get drunk halfway through. Let's just say I want to avoid it at all costs. Medium alcohol content, great for hosting important guests. I have an idea. Have you tried the drink I brought last time? Did I like it? Although I'm not an expert when it comes to alcohol, I do believe they enjoyed it. Thank you very much. It's great. I also sell this kind of drink at my Izakaya. My Izakaya welcomes you and your husband anytime. A quaint coin. I have no idea what I just gave her, but if it gets the job done, sure. Mistress of the Hata family. No. Three signed washi. What is a... I don't know what a signed washi is. The heck is a signed washi? Huh. It's related uh, to uh, Aq. Huh. Well, first I'm gonna go back to Ruma. Vivid bear paw. Ew. Imitation bear paw. I still don't want to eat anything green. I know I'm not. It's not gonna be a simple task. However, if I use Ibiruko pork as the main ingredient and soak it in a bamboo shoot broth, you can enjoy meat all you want while enjoying the nutrients for bamboo. Is that so? <laughs> I have a good feeling about it. Right? Might as well just throw pufferfish into it. Cute, tasty, and puffy. Mm, like this and this. 
Hmm, I know what to do now. It should turn out great. I got this inspiration thanks to you. Let me create a delicious dish that can dispel your regrets away. Imitation bear paw, huh? Puffer fish, bamboo shoot, and Ibaruko pork. God damn. The weirdest dish in Gensokyo. Since I can't, can't defeat a bear, it's not made with real bear paws, but with its unforgettable fragments, delicious taste is 100 times better than the real thing. But I don't have a bamboo shoot anymore, do I? No, I don't. I have to go buy another one from Rinosuke. God damn it. Alright. Hmm. I'm coming back, my super cutting board. Photogenic. Give me some ice. There we go. Man, I have spent a lot of money right now. I have spent a lot of money. Well, now I'm in the human village. Hmm. I guess I'll just do fishing. What do I need right now? I'm kind of okay on most ingredients. I need lamprey. I don't think lamprey can even show up here. That's the forest of magic. I'm not going that way. I'm not going that way. I'll just look for some fishing spots. Let me in Aku's house. <laughs> Let me rob Aku. Maybe she'll give it to me when uh, when she likes my food. But if I don't open the Yokai Trail, I can't. Uh, Rumi and Chen won't show up. Hmm. Where's all the fishing spots, dude? Salmon, shrimp, and seaweed. Wow, the resource list could certainly be updated, don't you think? Uh, alright then. Hmm. God damn, man, this river. It's hard to fish out of it. I don't want to waste any more time. Holy Jesus. Seaweed and salmon. No. Then we go all the way back up the river again. Hooray! It's okay, I'm still packing those 40 pumpkins. Where am I keeping those things anyway? This river is a bit unintuitive. Oh my god. Well, whatever, I need seaweed anyway. Really gotta do this entire goddamn jog. I got the egg up top. There's definitely less to harvest overall in this location. There's no more fish spots. Oh my god. Alright. That was a bit of a waste of time. Yeah, unless I open up on the trail, they won't uh, show up. I'll take some more lamprey. Or some desai. Oh, yes, right there. Okay, so I can open level three, but I can also open level two. Eight. Oh, God. Oh, I didn't realize there was flavor text for it. Not too much decoration, just adding a natural smell and smoothness of the calm, peaceful night, delicious food. A room thoroughly mixed with natural air around the Izakai, making the environment more appealing and welcoming. You can play six dining sets and simultaneously host six groups. Of guests, even more friendly and welcoming than soft lights, comfortable atmosphere. We also have some decorations and paintings around the dining space, enhancing guest dining experience with energy and fashion. Can place eight dining sets and simultaneously host eight groups of guests. Red lantern illuminating, not too much decorations. Um, chat. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna do this because I have Ruma and Chen waiting. I'm gonna. I'm gonna start level three here. I really should do Human Village, but I'm gonna do this. Oh my god, what the hell do I even prepare for this? Power soup. Oh no. What do I have the most of right now? 
Rice balls, boiled tofu, dried sardines, pork balls. <laughs> runny croquet, runny egg. Okay. We serve milk here, sir. Okay. So now I run I run the steamer, the grill, and I have two cutting boards. Nice. I get okay, I got a super cutting board and a regular cutting board. So I have a piece of equipment for everything except the boiling pot. Okay. Okay. Ready? I'm not ready. We're here. Oh, the establishment. All right, let's get this. If you prepare it on the super cutting board, it takes less time and there's a chance that a higher chance that they'll want another meal. So, all my prep work should be done. All my prep work should be done on the super cutting board, and the other one should only be used in case of emergencies. Okay. Hmm. I've opened an actual honest-to-god restaurant here. That's all. I don't know why there's a picture of Yuko. There's- oh, not Riggle. Oh, shit. Riggle. What do you want, Riggle? Abnormal food, low alcohol beverage. Sweet, raw, and meat. That's the steamer, not the frying pan. Sweet, raw, meat. Oh, God. Riggle's early. You know what that means. Low alcohol beverage. The beer, really? Sure, why not? I'll give Riggle a beer. <laughs> oh, now it begins. Uh, I know what Chen wants something. Sweet dish, low alcohol beverage. Give her another beer. What did Chen want? Chen wanted the power soup. Just boar meat and seaweed in the in the boiling pot. Okay. Power soup. And it has meat in it. Can I put fish in it? I think so, right? She likes aquatic, right? Let me see. Aquatic, barbecue, greasy, sweet meat. Yep. Uh... Remove the vegetarian bit. Yep, and I can put sweet into it. Okay. Power soup. And Chen's drink. Dry beverage.
Okay. Chen hates hot food. Well, maybe she shouldn't have wanted power soup then. <laughs> Obviously she hates hot food. She's a cat! What do you want now? I like sweets and a dry beverage. Sweet, western, photogenic, cool. We'll do that. That's a dry beverage? Dry beverage, right? Dry beverage. Oh. Hope you like that. Oh. Hold on, Ruma. Wrong. Correct. I have to make her that weird bear paw shit. Table three. Croquet. Okay. Table six. That's milk. Table four, croquet. Table five. Oh. Flesh, flesh, flesh. I desire flesh, bitter beverage. That's dry, not bitter. And I need the bear. And the bamboo shoot. What? Oh, and the steamer. Uh, 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 uh. Raw. It's already strange, right? Steaming pot, expensive, raw, premium, meat, savory. She like, she likes sweet, right? She likes strange, not sweet. Okay. Da 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 Number two, here's your croak. Rumi, here's your drink. Do I have boiling tofu? Number five, I hate the way the tables are ordered. It's so confusing. Pork, I don't have pork. Enjoy Rumi, or don't, I don't know, I don't know. Oh, she loves it, but she hates expensive food. Oh. Table eight. Why is table eight up here? Adjacent to table one. Oh, that's so confusing. Wow. Jokes and you made the freaky dishes made by humans. Okay. You want freaky? Here you go. I'll give you freaky. Uh, greasy, strange, frying pan, inexpensive, meat, raw. Okay. You want a drink? Bitter. I'll give you a beer. Oh, no you don't. 
Dry sardines. Have a rice ball. That's it. Boiling tofu. Uh, super cutting board. Rice ball. I actually made the wrong item. That's okay. Ruma, what do you want? Soda beverage and weird shit. Soda beverage, weird shit. Weird shit, weird shit. Oh. Hoi, yo, 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 yo. Has anyone ever actually bought the runny egg yet? Here, take that. Table six. Oh my god. Alright. Did I not give you the right one? Come on, come on, come on. Oh, rice ball. Nobody wants the fucking egg, dude. Nobody. What were you thinking, Regal? <laughs> the ability to lob things is very convenient. Oh shit, we're out of milk! Oh no! Uh oh. I ran out of milk! Guys, I don't have any milk left. You gotta go. Stop ordering milk. I didn't think I'd sell out of milk. I, I, I just don't have any milk. Catch. A last wrong dish. I tried my best, but you, you drank me dry. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. I got the important just parts out at least. <laughs> Money made. Partner salary. Wait, why did my why did my expenses go to three thousand? And my partner's salary was a hundred and thirty. Hold on. Where did that three thousand go? Oh, everything I bought throughout the day counted. Oh, I guess that makes sense. This is for the. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. That was a pretty pricey tool after all. I can't believe I ran out of milk, dude. I just wasn't expecting that. I wasn't ready. 
All right. Well, I'm gonna have to buy more. Get some more dew. Get some honey. Talk to my friends. Wriggle, are we best friends yet? How's the bug business going? We did it. You are a frequent visitor, aren't you? More information about Wriggle. She hates cool food. <laughs> you used to hate my cute buggies despite being a bird. What can I say? I'm a picky eater. What? You still looking down on us? Nah, you are my BFF after all. How could I treat my friend as food? Okay, sorry for being a little too sensitive. Nowadays, pretty much everybody is looking down on us. In the past, humans used to fear insect yokai like they fear Oni and Tengu. The sudden decline of the insect race is still a mystery to this day. Yeah, as much as I hate to admit, bugs nowadays are just too weak. Hmm. In ancient times, venomous insects relentlessly fought each other. The last one standing would possess so much power that even Tengu would fear it. But now there are no other yokai bugs beside you. Well, I can think of one. Maybe two. True, even humans can crush a bug easily now. Therefore, I will always thinking that as a leader of all bugs, I need to do something. But I couldn't help but feel lonely and helpless time and time. Helpless. Wriggle. Don't worry, I am the lord of all bugs. I will be back on my feet in no time. I'll let people know that not all insects are pests. And right now, I'm working towards this goal. I didn't realize you put this much effort into it. It's no easy task at all. Nah, in fact, I always feel that I haven't done enough. Wow, words from a real leader. All right, I must work harder as well. Let's make our dreams come true together. Yes, let's. Wait a minute. What is your dream again? <laughs> My dream is to hold a never before seen, the biggest, fanciest, coolest personal concert in Gensokyo history. Oh, that sounds impressive. I know, right? Therefore, I need to continue opening my izakaya and get enough money for the concert. Ah, so that's why you spent so much, so many hours in your izakaya. As my BFF, you have to come to my concert. Of course, save one VIP spot for me. By then, I'll bring a swarm of fireflies just to cheer for you. No problem, I already reserved a VIP ticket for you. Hmm, that's more like it. In that case, I will help you fulfill your dream personally. That's what best friends are for. Really? It'd be a great help if you could gather ingredients for me. Didn't wait more than a sec in skipping the formality, did ya? Gathering ingredients. Should be fine. It gives me a chance for my buggies to stretch and work out. Do bugs need stretching? Anyway, that would be awesome. Thank you in advance for all your assistance. Leave it to the great firefly. Alright. Uh... Achievement unlocked BFF not starting a concert without you. So... I guess that's all of Riggle's, uh, Riggle's ticks, huh? Although she looks like an Oh, hold on. There's a lot more information. Jesus Christ. An old friend of mine who loves insects. I can't really handle the swarm around her, even though I've known her for years. Although she looks like an ordinary yokai firefly, she's actually the last heir of a powerful ancient insect race. That's why she always acts she's better than everybody else. She always cares for her friends, despite the fact she sometimes acts she's in a bad mood. I wonder if this tiny firefly could let the future of her fallen species on her own. Me and Riggle are now best buddies. I have to go talk to Ruma and Chen. I gave them the food, though. We're improving. I haven't been able to talk to Marissa yet. Uh, and Kyoko. Okay. Invite about gathering. So what's so what's gathering? Is it basically just a uh, a more uh, a better payout, essentially on a on a gathering? I'd assume so. Ho ho. Hmm. Alright, well, I gotta go talk to everybody. Next time I'm opening in the human village. What's your opinion about the power suit? We've created it together, after all. I feel very energetic after finishing it. Well, it's designed to provide energy. What about your cats? Do they like it? They are more lively after eating it. They look very happy. That's great. They're so lively now there's scratch marks everywhere in the den. So it didn't work at all. I run out of catnip. Good morning, Chen. Huh? Well, what's wrong? Getting warm as cute as I expected. Your aura doesn't feel the same. Heh. <laughs> you can feel it. Now nah, I'm much stronger. A normal yokai like yourself can't even compare. The pressure from your aura does feel a lot stronger than before. How'd you manage to do it? Are you training in secret? Can't believe you're this hard working. No, I'll tell the truth. Right now, I'm possessed as a Shikigami. 
Ah, oh, that's right. You're not a normal Nekomara. You're also a Shikigami at the same time. Hehe. <laughs> now you know my true power. Right now, I can easily use super advanced techniques like Omoyoji and Kimen Dunjia. Oh, jeez. I definitely know what those words are. In that case, the actual strong one is the Shikigami, not you. Why does Chen have a task above her head? Uh, give four... I don't have enough money. Oh, that's a human expansion. Oh, I see. I can't afford that. I need to be careful with my money so I don't lose the deadline amount. <laughs> Alright, my eggs are okay. Can never have enough pork. I just sold a lot of tofu, so might as well. Potatoes are fine. Take the peppers. I like having seafood on hand. It doesn't cost very much either. I'll hold on to a few. Why not? Okay. What I really need is... I need... Actually, you know what? I need to make sure I never run out of drinks again. Sh straight up, I just... I, I can't believe that actually happened. I need to be careful of that in the future. Bruma, how'd you like my imitation bear paw? It's delicious. I no longer regret letting the black bear escape. You know what's funny? I gave her that, and then it was like, Rumia hates expensive stuff. Like, what do you want me to do about that? <clears throat> you don't get the ingredients till your shop opens that day. Okay, I'll do it then. That's great. Maybe I did that bear a favor. Is that so? <laughs> there are things that even a yokai shouldn't eat. However, a smart cook like myself can solve the problem by creating something similar, but more tasty. Cooks are great, aren't they? Okay. Clothes got mud all over the place. Getting warm proof that she has a heart. Even the ribbon on your head moved. Let me help you tie it back together. Huh, this ribbon. Wait, is this a spiritual amulet? Is that so? This, uh, sorry, I can't tie it together. Can you take it down? I don't think so. Then who tied this ribbon in the first place? That is the million dollar question, isn't it? Okay. Uh, let's see. Can I buy some more fruity drink? I don't have it on the menu, but it is pretty good. Alright, can you gather for me? Not slacking off. You do enjoy giving orders, huh? You've been ordering a great firefly around. I don't care. You promised me earlier. Don't you dare back out in the last second. This great one is no quitter. Just you wait. Alright. How's my honey surplus? Decent. 25 is decent. Hmm. I got an increased chance of finding stuff. I'm gonna go to the human village, talk to everybody. Okay. The harvest is back. 40 radishes, 40 onions, 20 pumpkins. God damn, dude. Alright. Get the daily chat in. Let's see if Ronosuke has anything as well. Nice. Got that Harvest Moon aspect to it. What do you have? I'll take your honey and your lamprey. Sticky rice. Sure. Kitchenware. I'm kind of okay with what I have. I wouldn't mind getting... I wouldn't mind getting some... Some better ones here. But I don't want to go too crazy is the thing. I don't want to go too crazy, but... I use, uh... I don't know what the human village people want. Maybe I'll hold off for now. I'll hold off for now. Okay. Hmm. I gotta watch my money, for sure. I went a little... I went a little insane with it, is all. Egg. Need more pork. More seaweed. Chili peppers. Tofu. Eggs. Okay. Time to refill up on milk. And... Great food. <laughs> I 
Uh, that really doesn't make much back, does it? Cost 20, and it cost, and it, I can sell it for 30. It's a pretty small payback. Okay. Here again. Sorry, we'll start teaching soon. I thought it wasn't class time yet. I'd like to reach the classroom a little bit earlier. Not all the students have to go there, right? Don't worry, I can wait. As an adult and their teacher, I want to teach them the importance of punctuality by making an example for them. She says, as it's like... School is overtime. It's four o'clock. I need more beer. I like the Sengetsu say. 120 yen on beer. Nice, 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 nice. We're gonna open in the village next time. I could do a round tour, but I'm worried about... I'm just a little bit worried about the, uh... <laughs> All the rare ones, right? Oh, Jesus. Cause I don't know anything about Kasen, Akio, or, uh... Hell, those two might show up as well. Now that I think about it. Hmm. I have no idea what they like. No idea. Salmon. One more gathering spot. One more gathering spot. Pretty please. That's all I request. One more, one more, one more. Come on, one more, one more, one more. Yes. Good, good, good. Seaweed, salmon, and shrimp. Okay, I just gotta pee before I start. One sec. Be right back. Alright. Alright. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Jesus. I don't even know what she just gave me. It went by too fast. <laughs> Here are today's ingredients freshly collected. Damn. Wow, that was fast. As expected of the great firefly. Of course. I don't even know what she gave me, but thanks. Okay, so... We know the rare customers who can show up, but there might be more. Because remember, there's a MC one. <clears throat> the SC, uh, the, the MC OC, and Marissa can show up here. So let's do level two in the human village. Who's Samon? Oh. Okay. Let's do it. Infested. What do you mean? I'm I'm selling I'm selling cooked cicada slows though. Okay, let's see. What's on the menu today? Egg? Right? Anybody? <laughs> any, any anybody want anybody want some egg? Someone <laughs> Please. Please buy the egg. <laughs> Stinky tofu. Okay. Uh, I don't have enough. I might have enough lamprey, actually. 
but I don't want to risk it, but it is signature. But if I run out of Lamprey, that's really bad. Um, let's go with the boiled tofu. Uh, rice ball. Dry crisps. Um, I didn't realize the croquettes cost 22. Jesus. It's a fucking potato, dude. Um, oh, I can put two more menu items on, actually. Fresh tofu. I'll use up my tofu stock really fast, doubled up. Pork bowl. I guess. And... Roasted mushroom. <laughs> An egg! Yep, that's, yeah, that's it. Egg. So... I hope that's good. Okay. Put the super cutting board in first. Uh, I have... Uh, I do need two steamers again, but this should be fine. It's not. It's only rank two. Okay. No egg here. So let's get prep work done. Okay. Music hasn't started yet, so... I got the patience test, though. Even if there's no notes, I still get a bonus, which is nice. This is nice music. I like this. Hmm. So I should definitely prioritize getting Chen and Rumia up to max bond level because that ingredient haul from Riggle was insane. And if I can multiply that by three, that'll be really good. So I'll, you know, I'll take a peek in the human village right now. But my main priority is definitely going to be maximizing my friendships with my friends. Whoosh. Perception is positive. I'll chat whose theme is this? You invite a character that can show up at any location. Oh, that's good to know. Good info, good info. Oh, here comes Renosuke. Oh shit, okay. Th those simple looking home cooked dishes actually aren't simple at all. Isn't it kind of similar to me? I want a beer beverage. Okay. Home cooking and beer. Do I have a home cooking recipe? Let me see. The seafood miso is home cooking. Do I have something more expensive that's home cooking that I can give him? Uh, the tonkatsu ramen. In the boiling pot. Yeah, why not? Well, I mean, the pork bowl is too, but... Oh. This costs more money, so I get more out of him. And he wants beer beverage. Do I have anything that's... Beer that's not on the menu? Or do I only have beer? That's sake. That's also sake. I only have beer. Okay. Oh, I can have three things on the tray now! I just realized what that means.
Hope you like this. Nice. Black Friday. Wait, what? He gave me a coupon. Oh, my man. <laughs> my taste buds have high standards. I know it's savory as soon as I taste it in a beer beverage. Well, he just liked what I gave him, right? The tonkatsu ramen. Oh. Trendy, popular, savory, home cooking, filling. So I just give him the same thing, basically. Uh, tonkatsu ramen. And seaweed. And beer. Is that a runny egg? Oh, shit. Runny egg. Unbelievable. Okay. Pretty good. I didn't- I don't know if- I guess he didn't want that this time. A true Chad can't move on with a half-empty stomach. I want shochu. You want a filling dish then, huh? <laughs> I have a shochu. It's, uh, fruity sour. He needs a filling meal then. Was that not filling? Filling, salty, home cooked meat. Yeah, no, give it to him again. Why not? Mm. Okay. Nice. Another coupon. Okay, so I get coupons from him. I don't, I don't have to spend a ridiculous amount anymore on his uh, equipment. That's good. To, that's good. That's good. What do I have in backup right now? Oh, here comes Kane. Croquette. I want some of the buffs. Okay. There he goes. Alright, Kane. I wonder what the history behind Chinese cuisines and a liquor beverage. Chinese and liquor. Do I have a- what are my Chinese recipes? Uh, that's Japanese. The spicy one was, right? The, the, the... Uh... Did I go over it? Where was it? There's Chinese. The tofu and the chili pepper in the frying pan. Okay, sure. It, uh, sure. Maybe she'll like it. And what was that again? A liquor beverage. Do I have liquor? Oh, they- okay, they, okay. I do, I do, I do. Wow. Alright, Marissa again. Okay. She likes vegetarian kinds of food, but there's something about that she doesn't really like then. Table four, table five, table six. Does a. The older it gets, the more legendary it becomes in a low alcohol beverage. What was it Marissa liked? Greasy, Japanese, legendary, trendy. But not strange. Gracie. Hold on. Trendy, Japanese, legendary, and greasy. That's trendy. She wants something legendary, though. 
So something that she wants something that the primary tag is legendary for. Do I have anything like that? Aside from I don't think so. Hmm. Only the uh the you dumb cake. Uh, has legendary. Legendary, and I can add. I guess I could just give her that then. Uh, steamer. Okay. Expensive. Um, can I add Japanese? Can I add Japanese to it? I doubt it. No. I can add Western to it. Vegetarian. You can add Legendary with the truffle. Okay. One of my meats is Legendary. Which one? This one's worth more money anyway. I know I have a Legendary meat, but I mean... I think... I think the, the tag that the dish comes out with... Like, the red tag... I think the one that, in order to get the max, like, a thing, I have to match the red tag with it. But I can add additional tags to it. I think? Either way, I'll just make this. Okay. I assume that's the case. Or not. It was good enough for her, but not, like, perfect. Okay. Bit of a shame. I guess I don't fully understand it. I have to match the tag to what they want, and I have to hit both of them. She said she wanted something low alcohol, but maybe, I don't know, maybe there was a conflict or something? Somewhere? I gave her the beer. Or maybe I just had to hit a, a multiple amount. I don't, I don't really understand it, like, at all. Like, she wanted something legendary, right? So I gave her- I gave her the cake that was legendary. She wanted something low alcohol, so I gave her the beer. That should fulfill like, both of her requirements, right? That should fulfill both of them. But she didn't, like... It wasn't, like, perfect. So I guess you need to give her more tags. So I needed, uh, because it was only legendary and low alcohol. And I don't think beer is iceable. So, there were only two of the six tags that I know that she likes, so I think you need a majority... A majority of the tags to be, like, enjoyed. I'll operate on the assumption. Okay. Okay. Time's up. Nothing in the storage. And Kassen makes it right at the end. Nice. Right at the end. Not all sages like to be pretentious. There's something unique and unmatched about home-cooked food, too, and I want a mild alcohol beverage. Let's see. Home cooking and mild alcohol. So... Mild alcohol. She seems like she would like this. And home-cooked. What was it that I had that was home-cooked? 
Would she like- would she like veg- I don't know, I feel like she wouldn't like- She likes sweets. There's no- no doubt in my mind that she likes sweets. So, let's see. Do I have something that's home cooking and sweet? Expensive, western, sweet, photogenic. Let's make- let's give her the Kadama ice cream. Uh, egg, tofu, honey. Do? Yes. Okay. Okay. Not bad, but don't feel proud yet. Okay. I still don't have any information, but apparently that wasn't, uh... That wasn't good enough for her, so... But I only know two of her tags, so that'd be why. If I found more that she liked, it would have informed me. But I didn't hit any extra ones. I thought for sure she'd be a sucker for sweets, you know? It's Kassen! Like that... <laughs> that's her character! Vintage beverage. Do I even have something like that? Vintage. Um, no. I have nothing that's vintage. So I guess I'll just give her mild alcohol again. Hmm. Okay. I'll try the ramen. I'll try the ramen out. She's not gonna like the drink is the thing, cause I don't have- I don't have a vintage drink. Not bad. No. Hopefully it's enough for now. Well, she still wants more. Good with alcohol and neat beverages. You can't have wine and ain't nothing else other than you match the dishes. Have to go. Okay. Oh, whoops. So, she wants something neat and good with alcohol. Uh, this is neat. And something good with alcohol. I know I have at least something in here that's good with alcohol. Um... Barbecued... Dreamy, inexpensive, mild, raw. Uh, the fresh tofu is... And it's got home cooking as well, and vegetarian. Yeah, let's give her the fresh tofu. Cutting board. And I get it on the cutting board, too. Wait. Wait a minute, what? Oh, and a radish, and a radish. Okay. Hope this works. Oh, yes! Nice! <laughs> Donation. Guess they're pleased and we'll continue... <laughs> Not while there were no more guests, though. <laughs> okay. Alright. So, uh, I just... Yeah, I have to match the preference on what they want, but also add extra things. But, if I had the Mistia set... Items would take longer to cook, but it's based entirely on their preferences, not what necessarily what they're asking for. Okay. 
That's a big profit today. And I got some coupons. But Aku didn't show up, so I didn't get the I didn't get any signed uh signed things from her. And now I can know I can Serial theft incident. A series of recent theft among the humans has occurred. Is the targeted act on against Sokyo's humans or simply cowardly bullying? Okay. So let's see how progress was made. So, not quite for Kane. Aku didn't show up. However, Kasen I can go talk to and initiate a new recipe quest. And I'm going to invite Chen and Ruma. And there's no bonding with uh, with Renosuke. You can't bond with him. <laughs> hmm. Who's stealing? Gather me some stuff, please. Thank you, Riggle. Okay. More Sparrow Sake. Ten. Nice. Any more Dasai? Nope. How's my lamprey situation? 29. I'd like a little more. Maybe she'll help out. I'll invite Chen. Yep. Invite Chen. And I'll invite Ruma. New products. Get some egg. More pork is good. Need some more tofu, of course. Always need more seafood. And more drinks. I don't actually need more radishes. Okay. Thank you. Talk to Ruma. I forgot I had to talk to them, and then I can invite them. Okay. Okay. I gotta talk to Chen. Alright. Uh, I have a item coupon gives you 20% off a of Corindo. Unfortunately, it will expire after the following day. Oh shit! Old coin collect the human village means not in circulation anymore. The Corindo seems interested in it. So I have two coupons for 20% off, but it expires if I don't use it now. So you can't hoard them. Oh shit! Okay, well, first things first. Good afternoon, Night Sparrow. Hello, Mr. Renosuke. I saw your request in the newspaper. Grace, let me explain. I happen to obtain a new video game console. While this console is difficult to use just like expected, it's more interested in the instruction manual that came with the console. Apparently, it contains a lot of interesting information about the outside world. Video games? Sorry, I'm not really familiar with them. No, it's something that only you can do. Eh? What could it be? The instruction manual mentions something like sleeping pills and hypnosis biscuits. Ma'am, you made something similar to those in the past, right? No, I've never made anything remotely close to those. Well, anyway, I just need you to prepare some food that can damage the opponent. Do you really not know anything about it? And the way you put it, I remembered something. However, you shouldn't use food as a weapon. It's bad to waste food. This is a very important experiment. How could you call it a waste? Just let me try the next time I'm at your izakaya. I sincerely hope you won't regret it. Okay. I'm gonna buy some more honey. 30% off. Oh man, oh man, oh man. So I have a cutting board. I can get a super grill. That's a pretty good deal, honestly. And a super pot. super pan and a super steamer I can upgrade all my base equipment right now and I still have uh, 11 days okay so now I have uh, I have the next set all with that 30% off is pretty good this is how he gets you Yes, <laughs> yes it is, but he, he it's okay, because this is good, this is good to have. Things are now faster, and guests are more likely to order, reorder, which, you know, you gotta spend money to make money. So, have Renosuke try out Dark Matter in your Izakaya. Oh, okay. I just gotta fail an easy recipe. 
seems easy enough. Alright, Kassen. Tofu stew. Miss Kassen, hello. If it isn't the owner of the Izakaya, hello. Hmm, well, in that case, I'll get going soon. Please wait a moment. Is it just me? You look nervous. Eh, I'm not. Forget it, how's business? Thanks to you, it's pretty decent. By the way, are you really going to keep opening your izakaya? Eh? Uh, of course. That's worrisome. Hmm, but I... You are a yokai and people here are humans, do you understand? Of course I know that. No, you don't fully understand. This means in reality that you are serving food to your food. And humans just outright accepted it, that's way too strange. You are a yokai after all. I know I'm a yokai, but you don't have to keep repeating it. During the couple hundred years I left, the entire world really turned upside down. The shrine became a gathering spot for yokai, and yokai came to the human village for business. Mikos and yokai, they all foregore who they truly are. Well, she's going non-stop again. Sages really like to lecture people, don't they? That's why I really don't want to chat with her. Hey, are you even listening? Ah, uh, I am listening. <laughs> Looks like simply lecturing you is just not enough. You, you want to fight? We're still in the human village, after all. What were you even thinking? Do I look like the resort to violence whenever possible? Then, then what do you want? Because I yet still don't trust you, I'll frequently visit the human village to make sure you never cause trouble. So, of course, my goal is to avoid and minimize all conflicts. If someone is trying to mess with you, I'll stop them as well. Eh, I don't need that. There will be another troublemakers in my izakaya either. Looks like you don't trust me either. Here, take this simple recipe. Think of it as an olive branch. Why don't you give it a try? Thank you. You going somewhere? That's right, I'm heading to the shrine. Okay. So she gave me a recipe for tofu stew. It's just tofu in a boiling pot. Cheap stew made from tofu. It's the most common stew in the izakai thanks to smooth, tender texture and nutrients. I didn't read half of these, did I? Soup with a perfect balance between meat and vegetables, seaweed, and boar meats. Quickly supply your body with the energy you need. Broth made from boiling pork and vegetables is essential ramen and smooth noodle enriched by the flavor of aromatic pork broth, filling and satisfying. Cake made from an ancient miraculous plot. The cake has a faint sweetness and leaves behind a lingering fragrance to help one remember the fondest memories. One of my signatures is the bizarre looking lamb freezer were once to talk against soak after frying. They gained a smooth and crispy texture, making them a very popular dish. Orc and trout, precious moose, small of the hat of the unconscious yokai, gaze in the infinite dark, it's one cutting and your beautiful soul. I've seen a few of these at this point. Mushrooms. Do you runny egg, man. Somebody actually ordered that. Three signed washi. I still need money. Give him dark matter. And give her tofu stew. Okay. Well, now I need to go talk to Akyu. She still needs to basically visit my establishment. But I have a spot open. Maybe I should invite Riggle because Riggle attracts customers if he shows up early enough. It really doesn't hurt to buy. Uh, it's modern. I only have one. Uh, somebody wants something modern. Oh, she's selling it for less today. I'll buy one. But I want more milk. And more grapefruit juice. Okay. Japanese sweet and small portion. I can add that to things, actually. Well, it's a whole food item, isn't it? Well, no, if I buy that, I can serve it, but I, it's not a, its not an ingredient. I see. Mmm. Can't get anything off of that. Mmm. I might have gotten a discount for level ups. Alright, I get a... I mean, you gotta chill on this, 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 this spending, dude. I'm, 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 I'm going insane. Hello, hmm, what's the matter? Last time I taught, I saw my students waving a strange looking big feather. That's me. Deep fried tofu. Kane Sensei, hello. Hello. I've seen you wandering around the village frequently. You are still a yokai after all. I hope you don't act too conspicuously. I've been throwing money around. You know, Jesus, good thing Jun's not here, huh? About that, well, my izakaya finally is a branch of the human village, so I, I was thinking walking around the human village would be kind of promotion for my izakaya, right? Hmm. I, I, I didn't see anything vintage, no. I've bought, uh, I've bought everything in the available right now. 
alcohol wise. And then nothing. I currently can't buy anything that's vintage. Not even Renosuke is selling anything like that. Well, I did grant you permission to open your izakai here in the human village. Just the yokai wandering around so conspicuously in the village is still a little. Don't worry about it. People are already used to me walking around in the village. There are even young kids coming up to me and trying to pluck feathers from me. I won't scare any humans. I'm worried about it precisely because of this. There are a mysterious balance between humans and yokai. As soon as humans forget to fear yokai, this balance will cease to exist. Huh? But, but. However, after coming to the village, I discovered there are actually a lot more yokai living in the human village than I previously thought. You know about this as well, right? Furthermore, as a yokai, aren't you working in the human village too? Indeed, there are a number of yokai in the human village. I also can see that you are not the only yokai who opened an establishment here. However, everyone else tried their best to disguise themselves as a human. Most people can't tell the difference. You, on the other hand, especially your wings. It's just way too noticeable. At least try to hide your wings and feathers. I can't do that. I'm not a fox spirit who knows how to shape shift. Mm, in that case, why don't you try to solve it with something you do know? Hmm? As the owner of the izakaya, you must be a great cook, right? Why don't you create some cultural dishes? Remind the villagers how much they used to fear yokai in the past by savoring this dish. I don't think that's how that works. Is this really not some sort of dark matter? Furthermore, cultural dishes, even if you ask me. Don't worry, I am a woman of culture. I can provide you with the recipe, you just need to follow it. Alright, but please do not scare my guests! Okay. So... I gotta give him dark matter, tofu stew, deep fried tofu. Good thing I bought tofu, huh? Okay. Yeah, nothing can be- not, I can't find anything vintage yet. So, that's a bit annoying. And you can't, uh, you can't mix your own drinks. You gotta sell whatever you can get your hands on. So let's go back to the Yokai Trail. And I invited, uh, Chen and Ruma. I don't really need to pick vegetables out of there. I wouldn't mind more meat, but I need the lamprey first and foremost. And maybe some Dasai, because that's big money. Oh, yes. Nice, nice, nice. And Riggle's gonna drop a bomb, uh, like a, a resource package on me. Oh, I'm not gonna make this money back. Wish I could get on that hill and get that flower, dude. Is there no way up there? Like, I know I got one, I know I got the flower from the kid in the side quest, but the fact that I can see that makes me think I can get up there, but I just... I just can't get up there. I just... I just don't see a way up there. It's... Ah! Well, yeah, she told me about flight, but flight doesn't work like that. Flight is fast traveling. You gotta come here from a different area. It is a rare ingredient. There's no way I'll be able to pick it like every day here, right? Uh, I don't see anything else I want to do in here, so I guess I'll just grab some stuff. Yeah, I might have to come around. Oh, baby. Thank you, Riggle. That's my friend right there. That's my motherfucking friend! Alright. Let's go back to the human village. And let's open up for business. Let's see what we got. So I have plenty of seafood. Uh, I can definitely get away with my lamprey today, okay? Rice ball, dried sardines, croquets. Now I have deep fried tofu and tofu stew now. I could put tonkatsu ramen on the menu. I can only make 40 of those. Uh, maybe I'd, I could put two more menu items. Runny egg? No. Plenty of seaweed. Kadam ice cream. Put the pork bowl on. And... Uh... Inexpensive, greasy, and strange. Uh... Fuck it, why not? Maybe someone will want the ice cream. Three cutting board requirements. Okay, so tea and the usual suspects. Uh, put the, this on. And then I have the super lineup, the all-star lineup right here. Look at that, super 
hot. Ready to go. Here we go. All right, prep time. I need to make some dark matter, so I'll just, you know, I'll just trash something. I don't want to make the tofu. Okay. I'll use a piece of seaweed and fuck it up. Uh. Yeah. Will that make it, or is that just gonna make something weird? Okay, good. Alright. Dark matter. Uh, <laughs> just hope Renosuke shows up. That's all. Okay, I got one of everything. And that's surplus. Alright. Unlimited patience. Don't have the big throw, though. Okay. How would a deep fried to potato taste, do you think? Chat, you ever have deep fried ice cream? It's, it's really weird. It's really weird, but it, it's, it's like not bad. I don't even really understand what it is. Oh, there's Kassen. Uh, what did Kassen want? She wanted, um, the tofu stew. Tofu stew is tofu in a boiling pot. That's it. Yeah. Vegetarian, mild, Japanese, hot, inexpensive. Pretty much is everything she wants except it goes good with alcohol, so... Let's see. A neat beverage. A neat beverage. She likes cultural backgrounds. Okay. Is this a neat beverage? It is. Well, I might as well get some money out of it. Why not? Not bad. Oh. I got more information from her, at least. So you just never pursue mere cultural and vintage. Ah, uh, she wants vintage again? God damn it. Doesn't like inexpensive foods. She wants a cultural background on her food. Do I have anything with a cultural background? Um. I wish you could sort. Oh, you can filter. Cultural background. <laughs> I have nothing like that. She doesn't like inexpensive foods. Home cooking, good with alcohol. Cultural background, Japanese. I'll just... What was that? The tofu, uh, the, the tofu, right? Tofu and the radish. And I, I don't have a vintage drink. I can't, I can't give her vintage, so I just gotta hit the other boxes. Mid-alcohol and neat. Give her a Sengetsu, say. Why not? Okay. Please enjoy. Uh-oh. She didn't like that, but maybe you should want things I sell. How's that sound, Cassette? <laughs> well, at least she didn't fuck up my establishment. Oh, I found Renosuke. He's going to destroy my shop. You want a beer beverage? All right, dude. Enjoy your beer and dark matter. Just so and so. Well. 
That's not fair. My combo took a hit. I hope Kasen wants something I can actually give her. He wanted to eat it. Cultural behind it and a neat beverage. God damn it. I just can't give her what she wants. Wait, Renoska, you still want to order? Oh, my friend's here. Let's give her the tofu again. A neat beverage. A neat beverage. Another Sengetsu say. Shochu and... Home cooked. Do I have a shochu aside from... No. What did I give him before that was home cooked? Home cooked beverage. Something pricey, right? Oh, the ramen. Right, the ramen. Tonkatsu ramen. Okay. Oh. Please enjoy. Nice. Ruma. Soda beverage and freaky dish. Okay. Soda beverage. Home cooking and vintage. Again with the vintage. Again with the vintage. There's no... I don't have vintage. Home cooked though. What did I give her last time for home cooked? Ramen I think, right? No, the tofu. The tofu stuff with the radish. Oh, man. Ah! High standards. I know it's savory as soon as I taste it. Savory? Is that a thing? Beer. What's savory? Savory, savory, savory. Oh, the bear paw. <laughs> uh, savory. Savory, savory. The volcanic tofu is savory. Trendy, savory, filling, home cooking. Okay. Trendy, savory, home cooking. That's not savory, though. Wait, do I have an ingredient for that? Do I have an ingredient for savory? Hmm. No. Save. Oh, I do. A mushroom. I do have that. So I can add savory to... Uh, home cooking trendy. The boiled tofu. Yeah, why not? 
boiled tofu with uh, a mushroom in it. Surely, right? Yeah, why not? Hold on, Rumi, I'm coming. Flesh, I desire flesh with a bitter beverage. Bitter, huh? That's dry, not bitter. Give her a beer. Flesh. Flesh. Meat. Raw. And strange. Yeah. Sure. That works. Accu's here. Okay. Okay. Oh, I gotta go hand deliver it. Nice. Okay. I don't have anything in storage anymore. Oh my goodness. It's a big line forming. Somebody better get up for Akio. Need that back. Uh, flesh bitter. Flesh bitter. Okay. Flesh bitter. Bitter, 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 bitter. It's fine. Kane, you showed up so late. Oh my god. <laughs> Time's up. I can't. I even if I shoot everybody away right now, she wouldn't be able to get a seat. Oh well. At least Rumor got me some ingredients. That's just unfortunate. Now I have to wait another day for that. The Hiata family is a traditional Japanese family, and I want a sake beverage. Okay. Okay, let me see. Japanese and sake. What do I have for that? Japanese and sake. Well, I can give her something expensive, right? Everybody likes tonkatsu ramen. <laughs> Wait, I passed it. Right, that's not Japanese. Uh, I'll just give her the deep fried tofu. Why not? Sure. I was supposed to give that to Kane, huh? Okay. And sake. The expensive one, of course. Akio hates greasy. Ah, oh, great. Fantastic. Alright, so I get to try that again. But this time I have more uh, things to work with here. Let me see. Akio likes trendy things. Trendy in Japanese, but not greasy. Okay, what do I have that's trendy in Japanese? Well, that's trendy. It's not Japanese, though. Uh, that's trendy. That's not Japanese, though. That's trendy. That's Japanese. I guess I give her a rice ball. 
A rice ball with sake. Sure, why not? <laughs> okay. Catch. Whoosh. She loves it. <laughs> Thanks. Assigned washi. I got one. Nice. Okay. All right, I gave the dark matter. I gave the dark matter to, to Renosuke. And I gave the, uh, what do you call it? Chen didn't show up. Chen and Kane did not, well, Kane showed up, but she couldn't get, get in the, the store and Chen did not show up, but Ruma did. Okay, okay. If I had something that like was a Japanese food, yes, I could. Cause I have cream. I have cream. Cream adds Western to it. Due to special events, Night Isekai can only be opened at Human Village. Please prepare accordingly. Okay. So I fulfilled those requests. So yeah, I still need to get the deep fried tofu to Kane. And then I need one more. I need two more signed things. Wait a minute. What exactly was that anyway? A washi signed by Agatha Chris Q, a famous detective novelist with countless fans. Maybe I can give it to one of her fans in exchange for something good. Really? That's it? Alright. That's fine. Some dew. Some meat. Doesn't hurt. How's my money right now? <laughs> I'm okay on money. I'm okay. Bye, bye, bye. Spend, spend, spend. All right, Riggle's now on the case. I don't give these popsicles to anyone. But I like I like buying them. <laughs> Support the fairies. <laughs> okay. I'll have a coupon, right? I have two coupons again. Oh man. Oh man, oh man, oh man. Talk to me, Chen. What's wrong? Your aura doesn't feel the same. All right. Well, Chen didn't show up. Friendship with Chen is needs to be increased. Please come to my izakaya. We must become better friends. Egg. Never hurts. I can make more stuff like that. I need a lot of tofu. I don't need vegetables right now. Chili pepper. Why not? It's cheap. What? Demand has suddenly skyrocketed for seaweed. Alright, fine. Not bad, not bad. Okay. I'd like to talk to Ruma. What did you just say? Hey, completely empty, number one. Come to my eatery. It's good. I promise you. Make a lot of good shit. Okay. Okay. I got one waiver. Oh, actually, yeah. Alright. Miso Tofu. Miss Hieda, may I ask what song you were uh, whistling just now? Ah! Did you hear? Oh, Jesus. You okay? Huh? Oh, I'm sorry. Was I not supposed to? No, it was just a little... Actually, forget about it. I'm sorry. I'm actually not a good musician. No, not at all. That music has a lovely tone. May I ask what the name of the song? The song was performed by an orchestra. Orchestra? I don't know. Gensokyo has an orchestra. Well, this orchestra existed a long time ago. Orchestra was almost completely disappeared in Gensokyo nowadays. Furthermore, I suspect the song actually didn't originate in Gensokyo. Unbelievable! Can I really not hear these kind of songs anymore? Don't worry, I've already recorded their history in the Gensokyo Chronicle. That's great! However, isn't the Gensokyo Chronicle about yokai records? Can it record other things? This... That is a common misconception. The Gensokyo Chronicle records not just yokais, but also notable humans, geographical information, 
and information on Gensokyo's culture, including music. I see. Of course, the most important reason is because I really like music. I can't believe Miss Hieda is a music enthusiast. Speaking of that, I have a favor to ask. Do go on. May I listen to that song? Of course, if you would like, I could give you a copy of the sheet music as well. Thank you so much. Um, isn't it human tradition to give return gifts? I would like to give you something in return as well. Miss Lorelai, you have learned quite a lot about human culture since opening your izakaya here at the human village. It's been three days, but okay. However, I'm actually not really sure what I should give you since you're the head of the uh, affluent Hieda family. Hmm, if you really want to give a return gift, then how about I make making a dish for me? No problem, I'm really good at that. I have a recipe here. It would be great if you could make it and give it to me when, you, when I dine at your izakaya. This is miso tofu. Is it really okay for me to give you something so cheap? Delicious food is delicious regardless of its price. I see. I won't let you down. Alright, so now I have, uh, now I have that on lock. Miss Kassen, thank you, thank you for the tofu stew recipe yesterday, earlier. It's nothing. I get to taste delicious food by giving you this recipe, so I'm not losing anything at all. Hmm, is that so? Speaking of that, I originally thought sages only eat something called afterglow. Turns out sages like to eat actual food as well. Of course, even sages eat a variety of food. As a yokai, you must have worked hard to become a good cook. <laughs> Thank you for your high praise. I'm actually quite kind of embarrassed. However, you can't be satisfied with what you have already accomplished. It must be even better should you desire to continue this path. Don't you feel that you are too carefree at this stage? You still have room for improvement. I, I understand. Well, be causing trouble. The only part of the reason, on the other hand, I freak with the village even before you come here. New pal, can I really be friend with a sending? Is that so? Then what does Miss Kassen usually do at the village? I believe as a sage, I have a duty to spread Taoism and its truth to others. Nowadays, there are more and more people neglecting their duty. I should. No, I must guide them to the righteous path. But thank you for your hard work. I mean, she's here to lecture people every day. Those who know the Tao are not extensively learned, the extensively learned not, do not know it. Miss Kassan, are you memorizing a poem? No, I'm reciting the Tao Te Ching. Uh, sages must self-reflect and recite the Tao Te Ching thousands of times regardless of day and night to gain new understandings. The training for sage is really tough! How about coming to my izakai after you train to give yourself a break? Thank you for the invitation. However, I missed several training sessions recently and I'm trying to catch up. If I still have time after that, then I may visit your izakaya. Okay, I want the, the dialogue more so than anything. How did you feel? Tell me the truth, I'm still pretty nervous. The power of dark matter, I have witnessed its power in full. I told you so. That's right, this is exactly what I needed. I can't believe the outside world has such a creative method of utilizing food. Outside knowledge is best. Really? Shopping. I'll take that lamprey, thank you. Some ice. Yeah, why not? Kitchenware? Those wouldn't be bad since I don't have vintage. I could buy one right now. I could buy one right now. I could do it. I could fucking do it. <laughs> I can have a sparkly cutting board. Wah. 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 <laughs> I can do it! <laughs> what else you got? It costs, like, special currency. But it'd be great to have those, right? I only need- uh, my debt is at 6,000. I currently have 5,000 and I have 10 days. 10 days, 10 days. 10% 10 faster. I guess you're not 8% more likely to order again. Oh, man. That, that sounds so good, though, right? 8% more likely to order again? You know how much I use the cutting board for with rice balls and shit? No, I have a, I have a super pan. The only one I have an extra for right now is a cutting board. Oh, it's 30% off! It's 30% off! It's extreme! It's an extreme cutting board! I'm buying it. I'm buying it. 
I bought it. I bought it. I bought it. I bought it. <laughs> I bought it. Ah! Okay. But I cost it cost the the red one. So now I have uh now I have a regular cutting board and an extreme cutting board. Okay. That's fine. My kneecaps will be okay, don't worry. I just spent a lot of money. Okay. Yep. Uh, 21. Ooh. Why not? Milk. Grapefruit. Nice. He had a he had a he had a discount on. How could I not? How could I not? He had a discount on. Okay. 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 It's okay. I'll be okay. I will survive. I'll live. No, it's extreme. It's extreme. Tuna, trout, shrimp. Nice, I can't use tuna yet as an ingredient. Thief in the human village. Nice achievement, thanks. <laughs> Great. It's just a picture of two eggs and a thumbs up for that achievement. Very good. I didn't get to feed Kane. I need to feed, uh, okay. But I did get to feed you. Your alcohol preferences are annoying. Okay. I'm heading back to my side of uh, town. So... I have 10 days to get 6,000. But I have an extreme cutting board. Alright, I have an extreme cutting board. I want a uh, Lamprey more than anything, right? Lamprey's kind of okay at the moment. Um, How's my honey? Honey's good too, honestly. Six Lamprey. With Riggle dumping materials on me the way she is, it's pretty good. I'm doing pretty good so far. So, yeah. I guess I'll just, uh... I'll go see what Chen wants to give me. Chen can give me drinks now, right? Maybe she can give me something vintage. Ever since that new shrine opened at the top of the mountain, there's been more and more trouble. They opened new divisions, even built cable cars. As a result, more and more humans are entering the mountain. Some of them even trespassed in my land! That's super annoying! Mm, humans nowadays are truly fearless, even I'm afraid of going near the Yokai Mountain. Speaking of that, humans actually pay tribute to those shrines. They leave a lot of alcohol and food there. The beasts usually finish out the food pretty quickly. Liquor is generally the only thing left. That's a conversation for being disturbed. It's not that bad to take some wine, right? Ha. Huh. Have a ranch, ma! Doesn't allow me to drink too much wine. I'll share this bottle with you. Wow, thank you. Actually, why don't you take some more? What you did is absolutely justified. Fuck time. Okay. Here's today's things. Thank you. Thank you, Riggle. Okay. I can only open here today. That's fine. Alright, alright, alright. So what's on the menu today? So obviously we get the lamprey. Uh, I want cutting board stuff. Cutting board stuff. I only- I have two cutting boards right now. Tofu stew. Miso tofu. It's all boiling. It's all- it's all pot stuff, yeah. Uh, cutting board stuff. Fresh tofu. Yeah, let's put fresh tofu and rice balls on the menu and... Sardines. Okay. I have my specialty. And then, do the croquette. And, I have a tofu dish already. These are all tofu based, so they'll get used up fast if I put them all on the menu. So the pork bowl would be my best bet here, I think. Yeah. Okay, so nothing too out of the ordinary then. Uh... 
Most common drink for a weak yokai. I can't even take a single drop of alcohol. Iceberg lemonade. Well, let's put this on. Put the beer on. Put the iceberg on. And then put the, the usual suspects on. Okay. And then we have... My extreme cutting board. Okay, all right. All right, well, I have an extra cutting board, but it doesn't matter because everything's going to be cooked on the extreme one. Let's get it. There's an event here. Detective Mystia. Things in the... My house have been disappearing in the thin air recently. What's going on? You too? Seems like a lot of people are talking about things in their house mysteriously disappearing. These things could have simply grown legs and walked away on their own. Oh, you'd think so, but you'd be wrong. Could it be that some yokai are doing this? It's not impossible those things can turn into yokai by themselves. It's true. Well, that's terrifying. I don't have the guts to try searching for them. It's really related to yokai. And I suggest you be cautious as well. Anyone? Can anyone help us? Uh, if you don't mind, I can investigate this for you. Really? Ma'am, you are so helpful. Well, thank you so much then. You're welcome. Just think of it as a thank you for frequenting my izakaya. Building up a friendly relationship with the local customers is a critical part of running a business. I can do it. Can you tell me a little more about what happened? It took me a lot of effort to get my hands on the newest book by Agatha Chris Q at the book rending place next to the village gates. Oh, that's where Kozusu is. I was so happy that I stayed up late and went through most of it and I almost finished it, but I was too tired and dozed off. When I woke up, I couldn't find the book anywhere. It's the most popular book right now, and it sold out as soon as it was on the sale, which means I couldn't, can't even buy another copy. I haven't finished the ending yet. Please help me find that book. I'm counting on you, ma'am. Okay, I think I understand what happened. Do you still remember where you visited on that day? I went home as soon as I got the book from the book renter at the village entrance. Oh, and my home is right next to the Dragon God statue. I'll go to the village and inspect this route tomorrow. Alright. Let's begin. Extreme grilling. All right. Ho ho ho. <laughs> Look at how fast it goes. I mean, not really that different. How you think about it? <laughs> it's not that much different. Boiled tofu. Oh, chopped tofu. It would feel wrong to take green tea off the menu. It's really cheap and inexpensive. Hmm. Hole. Okay, hyper mode. All right, and now we just pay attention. That's all. Oh, oh, oh! Legendary bastard has arrived. What you want? The older because the more legendary and iceable beverage. Yeah, why not? It's iceable. She wants a legendary. Low alcohol. Low alcohol and iceable. The beer fits better for this. In the mid-alcohol. Okay. Uh, legendary Japanese trendy. Legendary Japanese and trendy. I can add legendary. I need Japanese and trendy. Well, there you go. Do I have anything that's more expensive? I can't add trendy. Trendy. 
legendary, trendy. Oh, trendy, not Japanese. Ah, uh, shit. Legendary, I can't add Japanese to that either. Ah, uh, trendy. Not trendy. Vegetarian, mild, Japanese. Trend, oh, deep fried tofu, right there. And she just doesn't like strange. Yeah, no, I can do that. Um, legendary Japanese trending. This is okay with greasy. Oh, the deep fried tofu hits like everything. Okay, yeah, deep fried tofu it is. And give it uh, a bit of a legendary speak to it, I suppose. Can you add meat to this? I don't think you, well, you can. She doesn't care if it's meaty, I suppose. Okay. This should be fine, I think. Enjoy. Perfect. Okay. Oosh. Mami amore. Hey, it's Chen. Uh, Japanese food enthusiast, low alcohol beverage. Low alcohol beverage. I should like make a note of what I give these characters so I can give it to them to cover everything every time. This is my, my own notes. Low alcohol and iceable. Actually, can I just give it the same thing I just made? The frying pan tofu with uh, the legendary sparkle on it. There's Aku. What did Aku want again? Uh, she wanted miso tofu. Miso tofu. Boiling pot. Okay. Okay. All right, she needs new stuff. A heatable beverage, okay. Heatable, huh? Here. Hey, if it works for her, it works for her. Chen, oil. That's obviously the fish, uh, fish and lamprey skewer. She likes sweet things too, right? Yep, sweet meat, greasy barbecue. Cut tofu. All oh, the fairies are there. Oh shit, I haven't seen them in a while. Uh, fruity beverage. Okay, I'm coming, Chen. Should have gave her a better drink. Shit. What do you want? Home cooking and sweet beverage. Okay. <laughs> home cooking. Fungus home cooking small portion. Fungus, not home cooking. Small portion home cooking, huh? Let me see. Home cooking, filling. Home cooking, small portion. Nope. Filling, inexpensive. No, no, no. Small portion, home cooking. Small portion, home cooking. I'm looking, I'm looking. Filling, small portion, fresh tofu. Fresh tofu works perfectly for them. 
and give it some fungus. Okay. Number six. And a sweet beverage. Okay. Sweet beverage, sweet beverage. Popsicle, right? Yeah. They're like trendy. Eat fish and a fruity beverage. Okay. Fruity beverage. Dry and fruity. She likes dry and fruity. What did I give her last time? This was sweet and fruity. So she's definitely more... Do I have dry and fruity? I got fruity. What did I have that was dry and fruity? Didn't I give her something like this before? It's not dry. That's dry, not fruity. Not fruity. That's fruity, but sweet and bitter. Let's give her this. Why not? Cut up the tofu. The rice balls. No, give that back. Give that back, give that back, give that back, give that back. Give that back. No! For f oh, for fuck's sakes. Wrong order! Wow, surprising! Very surprising. Here you go, Chen. Well, let me take off the fucking thing. Okay. Okay. Sweet cuisine and a fruity beverage. A fruity beverage. And sweet cuisine. They like small, small portions. Something sweet. I mean, can I just give them the fresh tofu again? But add honey to it? That seems to work. Okay. That worked. Specialty dishes, soda beverage. Specialty with uh, raw and weird. Raw, strange, and meat. Yes. Oh, I got a lot of soda beverage. There we go. Oh. Oh god. Fungus and no alcohol. They like no alcohol. And they want something fungal. Okay. Fungal. Kassen, uh, cultural dish again. Oh, no. Just so-and-so. Okay. Do I have cultural? I still don't have anything cultural, do I? <laughs> uh, did I have to give her something by chance? No. Uh, home cooking and good with alcohol, cultural background, Japanese. 
She's hard to please. I don't have a neat beverage. I do have a neat beverage. Neat with mild alcohol. Mild. Mm -hmm. That works. Okay. What do I have in my cabinet right now? Okay. What is room I want? Specialty dish and bitter beverage. Closing time. The happiest time of the day! Uh, lamprey. Grilled lamprey. With egg, cicada, meat. Take. Take. I don't remember what room you wanted to drink. Bitter. Okay. Bitter. Bitter. Uh, cultural neat beverage. Oh, I hate you, Kassen. I hate you and your requests. I can't do them. Maybe I should have used the one in storage. Ah. I have that one at least. I don't have anything else in storage. Sengetsu so say is a good drink choice for her at least. And I guess I just give her... Just give her the same thing I'm giving everybody else. What else can I do at this point? Except I have one in... No, I didn't. Do I have croquet? No, I don't. Ah! Whoosh! No rice ball. I'm giving this to you, right? Yes. Okay. The shop's closed! Ruma, what do you want? Soda beverage. Freshest ways to eat something raw. Raw, huh? Uh, I don't have that. No, I don't have that either. Please enjoy. Thank you. Please enjoy. Can't have wine with nothing else. Something to match with a neat beverage. Okay. Okay. A neat beverage. And she wants something that's good with alcohol, right? What did I have that was good with alcohol? It was the fresh tofu. God damn it! Just... Take it. Flesh? I desire flesh in a bitter beverage. Okay. Greasy, strange meat raw, yes. And bitter. Oh, enjoy. That worked. Guess we'll continue to tip. Why does that keep happening at the end? Oh, she's not done eating. All right. Home cooked mild alcohol beverage. Oh man. Home cooked mild alcohol. I just she just likes the Sengetsu say. That's all. And it wasn't this home cooked. Yeah, this, this meal just works for her pretty well, all things considered. Here you go. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I don't even have to do anything for that one. <laughs> Movement speed up. I can move faster.
tips increase when her thing goes off. I think I might invest in the Mystia equipment because I don't really understand. I don't understand what I'm. I, I, I as long as I as long as I hit the tag, it doesn't matter. It's suppose I suppose. But the more tags I hit, the better. But then at the same time, like, I don't know. I really should like write down specific items that I can just give them, and it'll always cover their basis. That seems like a good idea to do, in my opinion, because I keep forgetting and having to re-go through all of the menus and stuff. <laughs> it slows the overall- I mean, I'll still be doing that, but at least I'll- I'll know exactly what it is I'm looking for right away without having to pop open too many additional menus, right? Irreversible option. Alright. Alert serial theft series- wait, I just saw that one. I hope Inari Okami will forgive me. A villager is looking for a chef who can help prepare tributes. Interested parties, please visit to discuss. Okay, how's friendship going on? Whoa, hold on. Is it just me or did Rumi's budget go down? Huh. Hmm. Chen didn't eat very much. She didn't stick around. She doesn't like stranger hot foods. I don't remember giving her either of those. Rumi doesn't like expensive things. Did I give Kane? I gave Kane the proper item, right? Wow. All right. Well, Kasen ate her fill. That's for sure. Uh. No, because she didn't show up again, did she? God damn it! Ah! Pain. Okay. Hmm. That's fine. Talk to Riggle. Gather me some ingredients. I'm going on a book hunt. Give me those popsicles. Look, my debt is almost paid. I made a lot of money that day. Despite the accident. Where I put something on their tray and the game did not let me take it off. I don't know why it wouldn't let me take it off. It let me do it many times before. Chad, I'm here to play with you. What's wrong? You look upset again. Don't pretend you are close to me. Huh? I thought we were already friends. Stop it! At this rate, I can't even. Can't even what? Ah, so annoying! Go away! Okay. Cheng. Please come, please come to dinner, please. Hmm. You get what you pay for. Oh man. The fruity sour sells pretty well, huh? Okay. Thank you. Almost friends. We're almost friends. If she visits one more time, we'll be we'll be maximum friends. Please come out to eat. We can become the best of friends. Okay. Alright, let's go to the human village. Snatch all the harvest again. Mr. Sen, you've been wandering around the village every day. Have you ever heard of, uh... I'm not wandering around aimlessly. I'm teaching Taoism. Forget it. What do you need? I heard there was a Soma noodle restaurant in the village. For whatever reason, they had great business recently. As their competitors in the same industry, I feel kind of bad just walking into that restaurant. It's not about competitors, is it? You're also a yokai. Hmm, indeed. If I die in there, it certainly gives onlookers a feeling that I'm there to cause troubles. But I really want to learn from them. It'd be great if I was actually a fox or Nuki and could shapeshift. The restaurant you mentioned earlier, I have heard a rumor, heard about it. Rumors have it that even the God of Fortune dined at that restaurant. The God of Fortune? The God of Fortune who can bring wonderful business if she visits any establishment? Ah, uh, about that. That's Kassem, by the way. <laughs> that sounds wonderful. I wish the God of Fortune could visit my Izakaya one day. How could I attract the God of Fortune to come here? Are there any tricks or bribes I can use? Well, she is still a god after all. I knew I should have visited that Soma Noodle restaurant. I'm so jealous. Enough! I had enough! What? Why are you mad all of a sudden? 
You guys are all so naive. What? what? The God of Fortune doesn't visit an establishment to bring fortune to them. She will only visit establishments that already have great business. Eh? Is... Is that so? Then... A small Isekai like yours would never succeed at attracting the God of Fortune no matter what tricks you use. <laughs> However, you shouldn't feel bad about it. Your desire to attract the God of Fortune in of itself is not wrong. But if you want to achieve this dream, you'll have to work twice as hard. One step at a time, gradually build your Isekai so that even the God of Fortune wants to visit it. I... I understand. I knew there weren't any shortcuts. Walking one step at a time is the way to go, even when I'm a bird. You show promises. Your brain is smarter than some Miko out there, even when you are a bird. <laughs> as your reward, I'll teach you a new recipe. While the recipe is simple, it should be popular as well. Maybe it has great synergy with your izakaya. Ah, thank you! Uh, then why don't you go and find some beef for me? Eh? Can't you just give the recipe to me? You just admitted that you should walk one step at a time. Why are you trying to cut corners now? <laughs> okay. A beef bowl. Not bad, you didn't just find any inferior beef for this assignment. I'm always serious when selecting ingredients. Great, then I'll teach you how to make a beef dome, buddy. I hope you won't forget our conversation. Keep it up. Thank you, I'll do my best. You're at our zoo at home. Zoo? Is that not the case? I heard fairies chatting about it. They mentioned that even the Miko trained in your zoo previously. Turns out it was just a bunch of lies. No, something like that did happen. However, that Miko went to my sage realm to train, not some zoo. Really? I heard there were eagles, snakes, tigers, and more. Eh, maybe I happen to have a little more pets than others. Just a little more? Okay, well, I'm not gonna invite Kasen. I should, but... I... I... It's not a bad idea to invite her, I suppose, but I'll, I'll, I'll delay for a little bit. Renoska didn't show up this time around. Tofu, sticky rice. He wants 18 for that, and I can sell 15. No thanks. Cuisine made during hyper mode ignores rare- Only during hyper mode. Rare guests will review based on their own preferences. So, okay. Well, I'm not gonna worry about that then. I could, however- No, I can't. <laughs> I can't. I can't. I can't. It's not a good idea. I could invite her, but I have other things to do first, before I look into that. Egg. Having more meat is great. I don't actually need that meat, but I'll, you know, whatever. Egg is fine. I haven't met anybody who really likes spicy stuff, huh? No, 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 no. Expensive sweet Japanese wonderful specialty. 21? No, thank you. Get some more milk. And some grapefruit juice. Okay. This is... Long blonde hair. Mmm, it smells like... This can't be wrong. It's that person. One truth prevails. This villain is... <laughs> nah. Well, I don't know. Marissa! What do you mean by steal it? It's borrow it. I borrowed it. Can you can the affairs of a scholar be considered stealing? Breaking and entering? That's not what it is. It's just that I was saw he was sleeping like a baby. And I didn't want to disturb him, so I didn't say hello. And what and then she ran. And then she ran. <laughs> I solved the mystery, but she got away. I forgot to talk to Akyu. Mm, Miss Hieda, I saw you dine at my izakaya last time. As a return gift, I should have delivered the miso tofu to your residence. But you visited my izakaya instead. I feel like I keep kept all the benefits. I'm actually kind of embarrassed. Not at all. I was the one who made the request, after all. And you did quite well. Moreover, you are a yokai, after all. Had you made the dish and delivered it for the Hieda family, it might not have reached me. Mm, the Hieda family is the oldest, most traditional family in the village. You are the family head. Normal for you to be guarded toward a yokai like me. Pardon me, that's not what I meant mean at all. It's actually because of my poor health. My servants always rigorously prepare every meal with strict nutrition requirements. So I actually don't have any opportunity to try something cheap and simple like miso tofu. I see. I wonder why you came to my izakaya despite having so many servants. Whatever you like to eat, just tell me straight up and I'll make sure to cook it for you. I am deeply grateful. Talk to me. 
Orchestra, so I accidentally uh, obtained an orchestra flyer. Many words mentioned in that flyer don't belong against Sokyo, so I hypothesized this orchestra as an outside world entity. Does that mean not just songs, but the band itself came from the outside world? Very likely. That's a shame. A shame? Why is that? Because then I wouldn't be able to see them perform. I personally prefer this air of mystery about them. The weather has been nice recently, even the night sky is clear. It's a pleasant and wonderful feeling. The night at Gensokyo is truly relaxing. I heard that you can't even see you can, the stars in the sky in the outside world at night. That's really unfortunate. So you need to treasure every beautiful evening. If that's the case, how about coming to my izakaya tonight? You can enjoy the beautiful night there with some great food. That's a wonderful suggestion. Unfortunately, I still need to edit history books tonight. I'm not sure if I can answer your invitation right now. No problem, come over anytime if you finish early. Okay. Can I get something from Kasen? I can only invite her at the moment, because she didn't... She wasn't... Not a gathering spot quite yet. Do I have everything else, though? I think I do. Some money. Well, at least Kasen likes the Sengetsu say. It's pretty good. Got a little more time left. Ah, there we are. Yokai, there's a yokai. Don't, don't be afraid. I came because you posted a request in the newspaper. You, you wanted to help me with my request? Yes, while well, I'm a yokai, I'm also a professional cook. Please give me a chance. Okay, my parents are super busy, so I wanted to help them whatever way possible. So what do you need help with? In a couple of days, my family prepared tributes for the Inari gods. I was thinking that maybe I could help them with their tributes so they don't have to. Got it. Speaking of Inari gods, they are fox spirits, right? When it comes to foxes, deep fried tofu comes to mind. I got it. Don't worry about it. I'll complete your request in no time. Fried tofu? Kane Sensei also knows how to make fried tofu. If I happen to forget, it's not a bad idea to ask her. So what do you want me to do here? Give five deep fried tofus. Well, I'll have to do that tomorrow. Because I have... Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six... No, I have five ticks left. It'll take me two ticks. It'll take me two ticks to travel between, and it'll take me three ticks to actually make the food, which is just gonna go to waste anyway. So that'll be a... That will be a tomorrow thing. Let's see. What would I like them right now the most of? Um... Not much, honestly. I'm kind of okay. I've invited... Did I invite Chen? I'm pretty sure I invited Chen, and yeah, I invited Chen and Rumi and Akyu. Okay. Some Dasai, good. Pretty sure it's just the food they like. I don't think it's anything more than that. Everybody's got a preference. I bought your fruity juice already, right? Nice. Get some meat. Nice. And lastly, well, bang, some lamprey. Here's today's ingredients. Fantastic. Okay. Well, I invited. Uh, I need Kane to show up. I need Kassen to show up. And I don't need Riggle to show up. But Chen and Rumi, I've invited. So, this should be okay. Let's do it. Alright, what's going on the menu today? Obviously that. Um, can I start putting some more expensive stuff on there? Tonkatsu ramen. Hmm, thinking about it. Miso tofu. What's in the beef bowl? I can only make 30 of them, so... Hmm. Home cooking, filling... It's trending. The trending items... Oh, that's why. That's why they want to buy them. They're trending. So they're popular right now. So I should probably... Keep that in mind. People want to buy the ones that are trending because they're popular. So I should do... That makes... You know, that makes perfect sense, but I never really thought to do that ever. <laughs> So let's stock up on stuff that's trending. A meat and trout skewer? Why not? Nothing from my cutting board. Uh, boiled tofu, fresh tofu, 
I'll take the cutting board specialty for that. And, hmm. Deep fried. And pork bowl. That's a steamer. Well, I use the pork in the... But I use the pork in, with the fish kebab. So do I have anything else that I can use? Tofu. I guess I'll just go with the regular rice ball. Because I can use that for a few things. So two cutting boards, two grills. I don't think any of this is, like, going. Okay. And then... For the kids. For the kids, some lemonade. Or grapefruit juice. Let's go with that. Okay. And then... Perfect. Alright, perfect. No problem here. Let's get to work. So, immediately... Wow. Okay. Let's just do it immediately then. Perfect. Haha. -ha. All right, one of everything on backup. Perfect. And there's the kebab right there. Whoosh. That's the good stuff. Yeah, the so everything on the menu is currently trending, so... No runny eggs here. No runny eggs. <laughs> Shortly, right? Oh, another one. Now we're in hyper mode. And they're done. Oh, Renault's case here. Regular kebab. Taste buds of high standards. I'll know it's savory as soon as I taste it in a beer beverage. A beer beverage, huh? Shochu and beer. Well, just beer is fine then. And he wants savory too, right? Savory, but he likes trendy filling and home cooking. Isn't that just the rice ball? Trendy, filling, home cooking. But not savory, but he wants savory. He, he specifically asked for savory. <laughs> Do I have something that's savory? That is also trending right now? Ain't that annoying. Trending, filling, home cooking. Trending, home cooking. Savory, looking for savory first and foremost. Filling, salty, nope, nope. Nope, nope. Home cook, oh, I can do the beef bowl, I guess. Home cooking filling. It needs to be savory though. Like, savory is the most important aspect here. Because that's the what he's asking me for, but I don't see. Do Only that, huh? Oh, this works better. Savory. Uh, thank you. What? Savory. That's it. Just those three. I. <laughs> 
the bear paw is savory and but it's nothing else that he wants like nothing else it's i i guess it's it's better than nothing it's better than nothing it it actually fits the criteria but that's still annoying oh god what was the other one i needed for that No, not ice, not ice. Oh boy. Can I add anything to make it? I can make it filling with flour, but I only have one. Huh. Oh, I can add an onion to it. That'll make it savory. Wait, it's already savory. Wait, 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 I can just add an onion to it. Oh, okay, hold on. In that case... In that case... What was it? Trendy, filling, home cooking? Just give the Tone Concert Robin with an onion. Will that work? Yeah, replace this vegetarian. Well, the vegetarian don't want to apply because there's meat in it, but the savory part will. Sure. Hope you like this. Nice, perfect. There you go. A coupon. My friend Ruma's here. Meng Cheng Guo. Uh, home cookers are, isn't that kind of similar to me? Beer beverage. So you want the same thing, don't you? Where am I? Same thing, right? With an onion. Sure, why not? Okay. Uh, specialty dish with soda beverage. Oh. There goes the patience meter. Okay. Grilled lamprey. Grilled lamprey with raw and meat. And strange. That's Rumi's favorite. Soda. Soda beverage. Okay. All right. Table three. Bye, Ruma. I want meat and a fruity beverage. Okay. Did you not like anything in particular? I don't remember if you had negatives. Nope. Meat and aquatic. Well, you'll like this then, won't you? What a pinch of honey. I think that was you that liked that. It is, yes. Table one. Fruity beverage. Okay. Uh. Oh shit, hold on. Uh, cane. Deep fried tofu. Uh, this one, right? Deep fried tofu. Can I add any other elements to it that she might like? 
Chinese vegetarian. Well, well, whatever. We'll just find out then what she wants here with this. Okay. Shochu. Okay. She likes shochu and cultured stuff. Okay. There's Chen. Whoa, Jesus. Oh, God. Ah. Oh, ah. Uh. <laughs> That's a lot of, a lot of additions. Sweet cuisine and a dry beverage. And a dry beverage. Sweet, fruity, dry. Sweet, fruity, not dry. Do I have? No. Let's go with that then. Okay. Cane. Chinese cuisine and liquor. Chinese vegetarian cultural background, home cooking. Wow, goddamn, hit like everything. Oh, do I have. What do I have that's. Chinese? Stinky tofu. And expensive. She just doesn't like greasy. That's all. Uh, Chinese savory photogenic wonderful Japanese vegetarian trendy home cooking okay how do you make the tofu uh, chili onion beef tofu on the cutting board okay chili onion Beef tofu. Liquor. Uh, do I actually have liquor? I think I. Yeah, I do. I do. Oh. Hope you like it. Good enough. Chen, what you want? Sweets and a fruity beverage. Well, that really ran out, huh? Okay. For tonkatsu, uh, number one, number three, Aki, what do you want? Traditional Japanese. Heatable beverage. Okay. Japanese and heatable. Uh, what did I give her last time? I don't remember. Uh, Japanese trendy soup. Japanese trendy soup. Japanese uh, the miso tofu works perfectly, huh? 
and it's not greasy. And heatable sake. How do you make miso tofu? Boiling pot. Oh, Kassan got a seat. Uh, of course, she shows up at the end again. Fruity beverage and the classic. Excellent. That's just what I needed. Fruity beverage. <laughs> Thank you, Aq. And I need a uh, Kassen. I need to give her something specific again and a neat beverage. Well, give her the shochu, of course. But what was it? The beef bowl. The beef bowl. The beef bowl. Just beef. Homecoming filled. Trending popular. Can't add anything else to that, so. Boiling pot, beef, that's it. Hmm. I'll take that. Cats eat fish and a fruity beverage. Alright, Chen's not leaving. A neat beverage. Uh, yes. Home cooked food. What was it I, she, I gave her before? Home cooked with alcohol, cultural background, Japanese. This one, right? I can't believe I'm wasting a tonkatsu ramen, though. That sucks. Same deal. Dry beverage this time. Okay. Uh... Something that goes good and then vintage. I don't have vintage. I cannot make vintage, so I'll cover my other bases. Good enough. Same deal. They're not going home. <laughs> They're not going home. Please. How do you have the budget for this? Vintage Japanese style. I'm giving you literally the exact same thing I just gave you, and you're going to like it. Oh. She didn't like that. Cultural dish, mild alcohol. Oh, man. I don't have cultural. Just take this and get out. Scatter. Beat it. What? I gave you the exact same thing a second ago. Wow, picky picky. Alright. I don't know where Chen got all that money. Oh, I know where she got it. From me! <laughs> she got it from me. I spent like 8,000 upgrading that shit. It's a very unfortunate thing to lose there. Alright. Alright. Good. Kind of a shame that I made extra of the tonkatsu ramen. Alright. 
Popularity is a gust of wind. Home cooked foods are no longer popular. Wow, good thing I took advantage of that, huh? I didn't miss the note. I, I completely missed the the notice that was telling me they were. And now I need to make fishy dishes, right? What do you want again? Five deep fried tofus. Okay. Five. And you know what? I can make something else just because why not? Nah. I don't care enough. Okay. Fulfilled. Expansion. I need one more of those. Go go talk to the girls. Okay. The lemonades are a pretty good investment. And get Riggle to show that she is the alpha male here. <laughs> the prime hunter gather. Sparrow sake. Okay. Let's see. Wow. Okay. So even after all that eating, Chen still still gotta visit me. Chen still gotta visit me. I'm gonna invite her again, of course. But Chen and Ruma are almost my best friends. Chat. Good morning, Chen. What's wrong? Your aura doesn't feel the same. Okay. Come on out, Chen. I need you to come to my club. Come to my club. Egg? Why not? Why not? Why not? You never know what you're gonna need in this world. Don't I always sell out of the fruity sour, man? It's crazy. Whatever. Give me the salmon. Why not? Why the fuck not? Alright, Ruma. How close are we to being best buds? Oh, shit! We're best buds! <laughs> What's wrong? You seem kind of down? Really? Maybe it's because I was a little too tired. Uh, why do I have to work so hard? Go to hell, my dream and ambition! Is that so? Hey, hey, you're supposed to comfort me right now. But you're not the kind of yokai that gives up easily, right? Well, it may be true, speaking of that, you really like to repeat that sentence. Is that so? See? Hmm. Ah, maybe it's because I want too many things too quickly. I hope I can be as carefree as you are one day. Am I carefree? Your motto looks like a question, but you didn't really expect an answer, did you? Hmm. You know, right? I actually can't see anything in my darkness, so I frequently run into trees and hurt myself all over the place. Right? I still can't understand why you do this. Don't you think it's kind of romantic banging my head into trees in the dark? Nope, not at all. It's exactly because I can't see anything in the dark, I can fly freely. Destination answers, are they really that important? Hmm. Your heart will guide you and give you all the answers. Is... is that so? Is that so? While you sound down, your spirit is never down. Isn't that so? <laughs> I seem to understand something, but not entirely. I'm just impressed by what you just said. Is that so? However, I know at least one thing. There's nothing to complain about if I already made up my mind. All I need to do is keep walking down this path one step at a time. Eventually, I will have the most epic concert in the entire Gensokyo. Is... that is so, for sure. I look forward to it. <laughs> Here, take this concert ticket. Please don't get lost on the way. Then I give you this. Eh? Didn't you give me a concert ticket? I also want to give you something. Romeo learned about return gifts. She's more mature now. Is that so? You think darkness is your ally suit? Yo, what the fuck? What? BFF. She does not like... She doesn't like unpopular foods. Expensive or good with alcohol food. Okay. So, uh, oh. Her head is completely... Born in the dark, molded by it. Pretty sure it's completely empty, but it doesn't mean much coming from me. She's always wandering around. I have no idea what she's doing all day. Every time we meet, she shares something I have never heard before. Where in the world she visit this time? The longer we know each other, the more mysterious her past becomes. If I ask her about it, she'll just say she doesn't remember. Nevertheless, we'll always be good friends. Always. Ruma is now my friend. Hold on. She won't- she doesn't gather. 
Is it because only one can gather at a time? I guess. I guess. I guess I got wriggle on it. Okay. Put on the suit! Alright, well, let's take a look around town. First, Xen. Miss Xen, thank you for teaching me how to make a beef dome buddy. How about it? It looks nothing out of the ordinary, but it's very popular, right? Indeed, it's a very straightforward dish. Hope your izakaya can be just like this dish. No excessive decoration, just capture guest stomachs without tricks. As long as you keep it up, I'm sure the god of fortune will eventually visit your izakaya. Yes, I'll do my best. Ingredients now. Are you looking for something? Uh, can help you tell me what you lost. No, I must be mistaken. Right, that thing shouldn't exist here. Hmm, Miss Kusen, you give out a mysterious aura. Really? Isn't it attractive for females to be mysterious? Is that so? Then I guess I should pretend to be mysterious once in a while. I'll burn the rest of my time. 30% off! What's this? Cassia? It's vintage! It's vintage, it's vintage. Wait, bro, you want 74 for that? I can only sell it for 60. Brew it in the winter. Wait, there's a, it's on sale though. What's the sale price? I can't tell. Fifty-two. It's 30% off, so it's 52 yen. So I actually am buying that at a small increase. But you know what? It's low alcohol and it's vintage, so that actually is worth buying up. Kitchenware? Ooh, but it's 30% off, dude! It's 30% off! But if I buy it right now... <laughs> I, can't. I can't. I can't. We're down to eight days, I got a week. My money is hovering around the deadline. Gotta make some more money. Oh, Aki first. Bye, bye, bye. Spend, spend, spend. Miss Hiet, I heard the Phantom Ensemble Band went on tour again. That's right, their music is very popular in Gen Tokyo. I also heard it's not easy to get a ticket to their concert. Kyoko and I actually performed with them on several occasions. The audience enjoyed it, but nobody ever invited us to sing for them. Don't say that. Your music is actually quite popular among teenagers. Huh? Really? That's right. I'm actually your fan as well. Miss Sieta actually likes punk rock. That's news to me. Yep, it's the scream from the soul after all. Okay, let's see. So I gotta go talk to Kane. Akyu. I'd like to invite... Uh, I invited Shen. I'd like to invite Aku and and the weather has been nice recently. Yep. I'll invite Kasen and Aku again. Get the early jump on on that one. Okay. There we go. I'd also like to. Ha. Ms. Kassem, what's wrong? My pet stockpot a lot of ingredients in my sage realm recently. I'm getting a headache just thinking about it. A headache? Why? Isn't that a good thing? Sages are supposed to live a desire-free, simple life, and pets living in the sage realm are sage pets. They too should follow the sage's lifestyle. Eating and stockpiling food are some of the worst moral desires. You are right. If you don't know what to do with them, those ingredients, and don't want to waste them, then I'll help. It's not a bad idea. I'll give them to you then. Really, thank you so much. Yeah, yeah, uh... Uh. Uh. Milk. <sighs> Pain. Kane says, like, hello. Hello. Oh, that's right. I have already tried your deep fried tofu. Well, I don't usually like to eat it. I have to admit that he did a great job making it. Thank you! Actually, I couldn't make it without your assistance. Tell you the truth, when you first told me that you wanted to create a dish to remind them of the fear in Yokai, <laughs> I really thought you wanted me to sneak some food and <laughs> poison in my food. It turns out pretty normal. My customers gave decent reviews as well. Speaking of deep fried tofu, doesn't the god Inari and fox spirits come to mind? Everything has its corresponding history, including every cuisine. You have to understand the history behind it to make the best cuisine. You still have a lot to learn. I see, I'll give it my best. Why don't you come to my school once in a while? I teach history classes very frequently. 
I'll go when I'm free. Hello, greetings. Remember Kane Sensei's actually half wear Hakutaku. New pal, easier going than that red one. <laughs> I haven't met the red one yet. That's right, what's the matter? Ah, uh, it's nothing. I just haven't seen a Hakutaku in Gensokyo before. I see. Are you curious about Hakutaku? Mmm, a little bit. Hakutaku is not a normal yokai beast. For humans, Hakutaku is an auspicious beast. Mm, why do Hakutaku get that kind of favorable treatment even when we're both yokai? Because Hakutaku will appear in front of righteous leaders and warn them of impending danger. Hakutaku are a beast that can provide people with guidance and solutions. Compared to a normal yokai, Hakutaku are actually closer to gods. I understand now. Kane Sensei, do you have plans after class today? I need to conduct class prep every day after class. I see, I was hoping you would come to my izakaya tonight. Look, looks like that's not really possible given the circumstances. Right now, I can't say for certain whether I will visit you Izakaya or not. If I finish early, I should have no problem coming. Okay. And I have all that uh, deep fried tofu for this kid over here. Uh, where is he? Did I- did I linger too long? Oh, thank god. By the way, asking Yoka to prepare tributes for gods, hopefully they wouldn't be condemned by the gods. Alright. Got some coin. Coinage. Got two hours to burn. We're looking good on stock... for that. Gingo. I'm heading back. Heading back. Okay, I've invited everybody in the human village. I've invited Shen. Um, I guess I want to look and see if there's any Dasai. Very pricey alcohol after all. Nope. Lamprey is doing okay. Ooh, that's good. Trends are over and dealt with as well. You know what? I guess I'll pick up that, uh... I'll pick up that meat. Nice. Here's today's haul. Thank you, Riggle. Alright, so I have to do it here again. Level 2. Open here. Yep. Okay. I didn't look at the outfit, no. I didn't go inside, I forgot about it. Okay, uh, currently nothing is trending anymore. So now I should just base my menu on what I can afford to make. So, obviously that. Uh, pork bowl is good. Tonkatsu ramen. I wish I could remember what goes in these things half the time. Tofu stew? Boiled tofu? No, not boiled tofu. Let's go with the fresh tofu. Uh, the pork and trout? Yeah, that's good. And... Let me see. Take the ramen out. Put the croquets and croquettes. And do uh frying pan, steamer, cutting board. I don't have one for a steamer right now. Oh runny eggs. I don't have enough for that. Very few things I actually have that use the steamer, huh? Can make quite a number of those now. Consider the rarity of the ingredients. Um. No, I don't want to use the fish. I want to use one that I'm like, have a... I'll just go with the rice ball. Well, that's... Hmm. Yeah, why not? Okay. 
the usual suspects on the menu. And then... Nice. Not that I'm gonna use the extra cutting board like ever, but I have it. Here we go. There's an event, so... I guess it's after. Alright. Let's not waste anything this time. Can't predict what's gonna get used or not, I suppose, but I'm also not using it when I should. It's the whole point of the surplus. An early build also builds up the, the buffs as well. There, one of everything. Okay. Perfect. I spawn a green tea. Here you go, cheap ass. <laughs> a whole seven dollars spent. Seven yen. Imagine just tossing a beef bowl down the lane. Like, goddamn. There's Kassan. Oh, but this time I got some vintage shit for you. It's coming. Don't you worry. What you want? Mild alcohol, Japanese style. Okay. Home cooking Japanese and mild alcohol. Let's see the mild alcohol first. Well, I mean, she, I know she likes Sengetsu Say. It covers two of her favorites, so that's a no-brainer. Uh, home cooking, good with alcohol, Japanese, which is home cooking, good with alcohol. Not Japanese, though. And Japanese is the one she wants the most. Okay. Uh, tofu stew, Japanese, home cooking, Japanese, home cooking. She doesn't like inexpensive is the thing, so miso tofu is, Japanese, home cooking is the best I can do here. Yeah, so miso tofu. No, 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 what was it? Boiling pot. Okay, the tip, the tip tiger is here. Now I get extra tips. I guess. Wait, she ate one thing and left? Oh, that's a bit sad. But you know what? At least she left her tiger. Wait, that's not a good thing. <laughs> Who's responsible for this animal then? Don't tell me it's me. you want sweet cuisine iceable beverage oh sweet cuisine but well, you like you like this right you like meat and aquatic with sweet meat sweet aquatic yeah Iceable beverage. Sweet, fruity, dry, and iceable. She likes the stuff she sells me. Go figure, right? 
Rice ball, fish kebab. Nice. <laughs> the tiger is responsible for it, so it better be. Hi, Chen. Cats eat fish and a fruity beverage. Oh, I know what Chen wants. Just give her the give the fish and meat with some honey. Fruity beverage. It likes dry and fruity, so. But again, I don't have that combination. Well, I'll just give her the lemonade. Ingredients from Chen. Why do I have a rice ball? Kane, what do you want? Aku's here now. You don't need to be fancy, just some day-to-day -day home dishes are fine and shochu. Shochu, I have one shochu. Actually, do I have more shochu now? I think I currently only have one shochu. The fruity sour. Yeah. Home dish, home dish, home dish. She wants home cooking. Home cooking Japanese, not greasy. No, 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 no. Home cooking Japanese. Not greasy. Home cooking... That's greasy, though. Home cooking... Japanese. Miso tofu works perfectly. Yeah. Boiling pot tofu. Don't even add anything special to it. Sacred treasures. She likes mild food. Okay. I don't know what she just did. Give me a mushroom and seaweed. Thanks. Roasted meat skewer and a stick and a fruity beverage. You got it. What'll it be, Mac? Nobody wants. Whoosh. Perfect. Perfect. Akune! Culture of buried and cuisines. It's not actually not too different. I want heatable. I'll give you heatable. Uh, what does Aku even like? Uh, heatable sake. Yeah. Okay, but what... Do I have anything related to cultural background yet at all? I don't think I do. Nope. Not a one. <laughs> Let's give her some Japanese soup then. Okay. Where's my soup? Vegetarian Japanese soup. Yeah, miso tofu. 
When in doubt, miso tofu. Okay. Please like this. Good enough. Oh, we're off. Oh, shit. What you want, Chen? The usual. I don't know what I expected from you, honestly. Fruity. Ha, 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 ha. Uh, Q. Premium. Oh, I don't have premium. So head of the heat of family, I have to constantly monitor my behavior and maintain my status. The food I eat has to match my noble. Do I have premium? Oh, I do. Oh. I don't have butter. I can't make that. I can make this. You don't like dislike that, right? Oh, I don't remember how to make that again. Steamer. Steamer with the flour and dew. Okay. Nobody wanted a croquet. Sake beverage. Hope you enjoy. Oh, perfect! <laughs> Excellent! Same thing. Same thing. Chen just puts the skewers down. Just give her some Kadama lemonade and some skewer and she's good to go. Alright. Oh, that time she didn't give me anything good for it. I must have read the beverage wrong. A dry beverage. Dry. Dry and fruity. Right, that doesn't exist. So just sparrow sake. That should work. What? Okay. Traditional Japanese heatable beverage. Traditional Japanese. Oh boy. Aku likes sweet stuff. What do I have that's Japanese? And not greasy. She doesn't like greasy. Um, Japanese filling and expensive, greasy miso tofu again. Home cooking Japanese soup. Yeah, why not? The miso tofu seems to work pretty well. I don't understand why Chen didn't like. Uh, I don't understand why Chen didn't. I mean, I get maybe it's because it's the same thing over and over and over again. Of course, that would make sense to me. But I didn't change what I gave her, but I met like all her criteria. So I don't know why she stopped uh, like loving it, I suppose. Hmm. Was she asking for greasy? Was that part of her profile? Oh yeah, no, you're right. You're right. You're right. She does ask for greasy, which the, the, the skewer is not. It's not greasy. Uh, miso tofu. 
restaurant sake, right? Heatable beverage, yeah. Enjoy! Perfect. Thank you for the signed wafer. I don't know what to do with them. 25, sparrow time, buff duration increased. Just made over four, uh, four grand. Uh, it's still climbing. Ma'am, ma'am. Dear guests, we're closed tonight and the food's already. No, 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 I'm not here to eat. I heard that you helped my neighbor get something back. That's what I'm here for. I feel like my izakaya is becoming some other kind of establishment. Anyways, there's this jade pendant that I wore every day. Oh, my God. And I put it under my pillow before going to sleep yesterday night. But it was gone when I woke up the next day. Although my pendant style is a bit outdated, the jade's texture is genuinely of first-class quality. Uh, I was supposed to be a heirloom my mom prepared for my future bride. Now that I've lost the pendant without even a girlfriend, my mom's gonna kill me when she finds out. Please, ma'am, you gotta help me find out. Find it. I see your house is close to the previous guest, right? Right? I also live by the dragon god statue. The feng shui should have been excellent. How can things like this happen? All right, I'll go look around tomorrow. Surely that's not Marissa again, right? All right. So nobody wanted a croquet. That's unfortunate. But look at the money I made today. But wait, how did I spend twelve hundred? How did I do that? Hmm. All right. I still haven't got hit by a punishment spell card. That worries me. <laughs> I don't know what that is, but I have a feeling that's gonna be a that's gonna be a problem at some point. Okay, make my save, and this is where the game will end for the day. And yes, it has been it has been five hours again. You think darkness is your ally? A completely back suit given by the dusty yokai. It's actually just the original cloth, but dyed black. The eye shade is interesting, though. You can wear it in front of the closet at home. What the fuck is this suit, dude? <laughs> uh, yeah, it's just... <laughs> just goth mystia with a night mask. Why does she have a night mask? <laughs> okay. Yeah, there you go. I'm, I'm done. I'm done. That was five hours again. Uh, so... When I'm done, if I, I can just go talk to Chen and our bond, you know will be perfected. Uh, Kassen only stopped for one meal. Uh, Kane only stopped for like one or two meals. Akio, however, was there for a while. So, that's good. That's good progress on those three. Marissa, I can't talk to her, but you know, she's shown up a few times. And the other ones... Oh, hold on. I can see their cards when I'm friends. Summon a large group of flying insects and they bite will drive away every single guest in the izakaya for a small restaurant. This is a very scary skill. It's not going to fly with the health inspector. Release darkness in the kitchen, making it impossible to tell where's what, including the wine cabinet. It lasts 20 seconds. Oh, jeez. Uh, Cassandra's seen enough. She's satisfied. <laughs> she asked her pet tiger to perform for her, but you were the one who got tipped. Every once in a while, one, every guest dining waiting, uh, in the waiting line will tip you randomly between 1 and 30 yen. Three sacred treasures soar. Randomly obtain two kind of vegetables. Mirror. For the next 15 seconds, new dishes will not cost any ingredient. What? That's crazy. Wow. Jade. Open up the lock to the heart. Randomly reveal a special guest's unknown secret. Assuming they still have unknown secrets left. So I guess that exposes a, an interest or something like that. That one, I hope I don't roll that one too often. Village. Kamishiro Sawa-sensei has seen enough. She is satisfied. She will personally promote your izakaya, attracting many villagers to come and dine. Isn't it common sense for three sacred treasures to have four? Obtain a signed washi by a famous novelist. You can exchange something special for it. Randomly obtain three fish ingredients. So I don't... So you get the info on their their mean their mean girl card if, when, you, when you become best friend. Obtain one Corindo 30% off coupon. Okay, so they don't stack. They don't stack, you just get one, and you get 30% off. I see. Okay. <laughs> okay, okay. But yeah, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. Uh, back to main menu. <clears throat> the Kassem one's nice. Kane's has the potential to be kind of crazy. Because you can prepare some really high-grade, like, stuff. 
ahead, like, in those 15 seconds without spending resources. If you know that certain rare guests will like, like, certain, uh, things, you can definitely make a bunch of really expensive shit. Alright, so Chad, I have effectively played this game for 10 hours. And I'm in area 2. I've... Look at... Look at all these characters on the screen right now. And count how many of them have actually stopped by to eat at my eatery. Alright? <laughs> I count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Five characters have, on the screen right now have actually showed up to eat. Kyoko is, Kyoko is my friend. She, she works with me. She's my buddy. <laughs> this game is fantastic. Now, I promise I won't play it again tomorrow. I, I swear. Actually, I don't, I don't promise anything. I owe you nothing. No promise. Ten hours. Maybe, maybe I cool off for a weekend. You know, play something else, but if... <laughs> it's a good game. It's really hard to stop. It's just a really hard game to stop playing. So <laughs> I might. I might, but I'll, you know, I'll, I'll try not to. But if I, if I wake up and I really just feel like playing it again, I will. But I'll try to hold off for just one extra day because it's, it's an addictive game. What can I say? It's very fun. But I do want to, like, you know, make a notepad of stuff i suppose to like what works for the characters maybe i will maybe i won't we'll see